Denied. The station does not allow for manual docks. Throttle down or spin to a go-round. It's your choice. Negative on the go-round, Angel. This isn't a military dock, 4-7. We're civilian medical on loan to the UNSC. You try manual dock and you'll tear a hole not in Not my call, Angel. Patient is level zero. Level zero? We're gonna need confirmation for that, 4-7. Angel on my shoulder. This is Director Church. I respectfully request your assistance. Our situation is rather dire. Prep the patient. Well, I guess so much for our go round. Uh, I heard that 479er. Yep, that's because I transmitted it. Greetings, Director. Was that Agent Maine? We picked up his beacon. At least we know that system works. Do you know what happened? I know who will. Launch him, let's move, we're losing him. Can't you stabilize him? Doing our best, sir. Is there something I can do? Sorry, sir, you're gonna have to wait here. Medical crew only. <sighs> Typical medic bullshit. Paging Dr. Ross. <laughs> Agent Washington, status report. Maine was injured, sir. We failed the objective. How were two soldiers of your caliber possibly hurt by simulation troopers? They... got the jump on us. Disappointing, but we'll deal with that after surgery. Yes, sir. Come on, buddy, hang in there. How is he? Oh, hey man. Not good. He was shot in the throat. The medic said even if he survives, he'll probably never talk again. How's your eye? Docs are letting me out tomorrow. Seems like a lot of people are getting hurt these days. Yeah. It's just that everything seems to be moving so much more quickly now. The suits, the missions, and now these, what do they call them, AI things? York, do you think we're moving too fast? The whole universe is moving too fast, Wash. I think we're just trying to keep up. Come on! Get 
up here! Yeah, okay, hold on! For God's sake, I'm coming. Shut up! Goddamn, I can't even have one fucking moment to myself. Can't even be alone with my thoughts. Not even for a second. Somebody's always gotta fucking yell, or scream, or, Come look at this! What's going on over here? Or, Hey, church, help me out! I don't know what the fuck I'm doing! Fucking assholes. God, I forgot how much this place sucks. Now when he gets up there, remember the plan. Plan? What plan? We only have one shot at this. Don't let it fall apart. Why are you talking to me like this is supposed to make sense? Is this another one of your idiot schemes to make church your best friend? Okay, shh. Remember, let me do the talking. Do the talking about what, idiot? Don't worry, I've got this. What would I be worried about? I don't even know what you're doing. <sighs> Woo. Hey, church. Welcome to the cliff. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Man. Woo. Okay, abort. The plan did not work. That was it? Okay, now I actually want to know. What was the plan? Because apparently phase one was saying hi. What was next? Were you going to wave? Abort. Abort. Oh, what do you guys, uh, what do you guys want? Dude, are you fucking dying? You sound like my vacuum cleaner when it picks up a penny. I'm just a little, uh, out of breath. I'm not used to this. It's been a while since I, uh, had a human body. Oh, God, I know. I, I hate having one of those. It, it, like, it always wants to pee. Like, all the time. What the fuck is everyone talking about today? Did I miss a staff meeting? What other body would you have? It's, uh, it's a long story. Remind me to tell you sometime. So, uh, what's up? What's going on? We have movement over at the Red Team's base. I thought we should check it out. Actually, I thought we should ignore it, but there's really not anything else to do. Movement? What kind of movement? The right kind. Remember that new vehicle they got? They've been making modifications to it. Well, that doesn't sound good. How are they modifying it? I don't know. Why are you asking me? Wait, you've been up here watching them all this time. Can't you make a guess? Well, I don't know, man. They sure as hell ain't installing a stereo. Thanks. Caboose, what do you think it is? Yeah, actually, I was gonna say stereo, but now it seems like a bad idea to say that, so now I'm going to say... radio. That's the same thing, idiot. Yep, I know. But I still think I won somehow. Here, let me see the sniper rifle. I'll check for myself. Do you even know how to use that thing? Do I know how to use it? Of course I know how to use it. Don't, uh... Hey, where's the, um... How do I make it do the thing? The, the, the thing where everything gets closer, everything gets closer and bigger. How do I do the closer, bigger thing with it? You mean zoom? Zoom. Yeah, that's it. Zoom. What are you saying? Do I say zoom? Zoom. Zoom. Rifle. Press the black button. Oh. Shut up. Hey, I didn't say a word, dude. Okay, that'll do her. Fire it up, boss. Let's test this bad boy out. Simmons, hop up. Huh. Yeah, it looks like they've modified their Jeep. They changed the turret. What is that, like some kind of radar dish? I think it's a rocket launcher. That's impossible. You can't fire rockets from a Jeep, dumbass. There'd be too much, uh, torque or something like that. It's probably some kind of, like, microwave transmitter. Well, they were loading rockets in it earlier, so unless they were microwaving explosives for a tasty snack, it's probably a rocket launcher. Oh, great. Now I want a snack. Hey! Didn't you hear what I said about the torque? It's probably like- Son of a bitch! Yeah, I'm feeling pretty confident about my rocket launcher guess. Yeah, I, I don't know. I think Church was right. I'm pretty sure I just torqued in my pants. Ah! He me right all the time! Yeah! Almost got you that time, sluts! Reload, Simmons! Alright! Let's put the next one right up their ass! Um, okay, sure, but you don't need to say it like that. I think the weapon is equally as effective, no matter where it hits them. Start stuffing, Simmons! Okay, okay. Was that Donut? I don't know, that's the chick who was working on the jeep. It's not a girl, Tucker. He just wears pink armor. It's a guy. It is? Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Uh... Then I suddenly feel pretty awkward about something I did 20 minutes ago. During alone time. What the hell is alone time? Hey, it's one of the rules of the cliff, dude. What happens in alone time stays in alone time. What do you do during alone time, Caboose? Oh, I do the same stuff I do during together time. Only half. What? Another benefit of alone time? Not listening to him for a few minutes. Hoorah, bitches! Who fucking raw? Yeah, take that, Blues! Next one is blowing your armor clean off! Or it'll just hurt you a lot, you know? Some of us realize that's enough! Why do you keep making it weird? Damn it! Rocket Jeeps? Donut giving orders? This is getting ridiculous. I'm putting a stop to this. Church! Wait! Tucker! Get down! They're firing again! That wasn't a rocket. That was something else. Church, where are you going? Church! To set things straight, Tucker! If we're gonna do this, it has to be done the right way, or there's no point in doing it at all, okay? 
There's an order to things, Tucker. An order. Order. Our operatives are in position, Director. Good. Send them in. If I may say, sir, my testing indicates that this might not be the best... The system will determine what's best, Counselor. The system will determine the order. Send them in. Greetings, fellow web surfer. Be sure to subscribe to our channel before you go. It'll be just like we're friends. Not that I need friends. <laughs> Please don't go. Our operatives are in position, Director. Good. Send them in. If I may say, sir, my testing indicates that this might not be the best team for the job. The system will determine what's best, Counselor. The system will determine the order. Send them in. Christ, is it cold or what? How cold do you think it is? It, it has to be below freezing, right? Well, there's ice, so yeah, freezing. Patrolling in the ice, give me a fucking break. Mm -hmm. You know who doesn't have patrol in the middle of the night in the ice? I'm sure you'll tell me. Jenkins. Yeah. I bet Jenkins is sleeping right now. Back in his rack with his big fucking melon head on a soft pillow. Yeah, it's Jenkins. You know I had terminal duty eight weeks straight? Eight weeks, man. Ah, lucky you. Then I make one fucking comment about huh? the CO That's to great. Jenkins, and the next thing you know, I'm out on patrol. <laughs> Jenkins gets my terminal duty, and I get to freeze my ass off out here with... Murphy! Come on, Murphy. Hey, where are you? Murph. Stop messing around, Murph. Murph. Yeah, I'm in here. I thought I heard something. Oh yeah? What'd you hear? A ghost? <laughs> huh? Yeah, I guess you could say something like that. What the fuck? Ooh. Hey, we clear? Yes, South, you're clear, but watch your corners. The smoke is good for cover, but it's playing hell with my thermals. The cold isn't helping. What's the time? Don't worry about the time. Worry about the objective. Next patrol's in 20 seconds. Huh, I'll be gone before that. Okay, slow down, South. Set your motion trackers. <laughs> nah, takes too long. Soda's getting caught. Set your trackers. South, I do not have visual in there. I can't be your eyes if I can't see. Just trust me, North. I got this. South, talk to me. Not right now, North. I see the objective. Going to initiate transfer. While it's loading, set your goddamn tracker. There's bound to be some... South, I've got something out on thermal. Two small dots. Come on, come on. South, check your six. I think something's in there. Don't even think about it. Ah, oh, shit. About to get loud. So much for keeping quiet. South, meet me at the helipad for extraction. Roger. Might need a minute.
Situation is critical, sir. Should we do something? Yes. Send her in. Roger that. Come in, number one. Number one, you are green. Activate fail safe. Copy, sir. Initiating beta. Well, out of the frying pan and into the fire. Uh, I think I could take about 50 of them. How about you? How about you save your jokes until we get out of this? Where the hell is extraction? Attention, assholes! Stand down, you're surrounded! Give us the data file now! You will be taken into custody! We can either do this the easy way or the hard way! There is no escape, so give us the damn data file! <laughs> bother you, but I think that's my rifle you're holding. What the hell are you talking about? Just grab any rifle! Like, look at that! There's seriously a pile of rifles! No, that's my good right luck there, rifle! That's the one I sleep with every are night! Are you kidding me, man? No! Yeah, we know it's you, 
dipshit. That's why we're shooting. I just want to talk for a second. Yeah, so what? What does that mean? Yeah, I just want to talk to you about... Uh... Something. Oh, shit. I think I fucked up. I fucked up, didn't I? You guys don't know who I am. Maybe we should give him a chance. See what he has to say. He could provide some intel by accident. Or give us the blue perspective. I always wanted to hear that. I want to shoot him. Okay, just to be clear, I understand what you meant by that. I get that you want to shoot him with bullets. Red hot bullets. Please, it's enough. Let's hear him out. Then you shoot him. How about I just wound him? Then he can still talk, and I get to shoot him. That's a win-win. Not for me, I get shot. Okay, how about this? Dona gets to shoot you in exchange for you getting to say what you need to say. Five minutes of talking for one shot. Where do you want it, Blue? The shoulder or the foot? Well, obviously I would pick the foot, but I don't want you guys to shoot me and deal. <laughs> Ow! Son of a bitch! Okay, your five minutes have started. Go. Where am I? Oh, well, that looks nice. Oh my god! A giant person! What happened? One of the Reds just shot Church in the foot! Ow! The fucking heart! Do you think we should try to help? I don't really see how we can. I can't really get a clear shot at Church from this angle. How? Man, you guys are a bunch of dicks! I just got this foot! Four minutes left. I just want to say, you guys are all mixed up. You're doing it wrong. Doing what wrong? This! Your team! Like, where's Griff? He's in the base, cleaning up. He loves to keep things tidy. No, 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 no. See? That's not right. This isn't the way things are supposed to be. They got all confused somehow. Griff isn't tidy at all. He's filthy. He's gonna wash his hands for a week if he hears you say that. Griff, come on, get out of here, man. I'm doing my second coat of floor wax. That's where the shine comes to life. I'll be out in a minute. Ugh. Sarge, come on, be Sarge. Yell at him. Get him out here. Why would I yell at a subordinate? Seems unfair to yell at someone who can't yell back. What? That's what? Hey, sorry about calling you fellas subordinates. That's so lame. No offense, man. None taken, boss. I actually kind of like being talked down to. Okay, seriously, Sarge, come on. You love being in charge. Tell these guys to, you know, shape up or do something. Well, I guess they could be doing a better job. How? Uh, I just want you guys to feel like you're reaching your full potential. I know I am. Me too. My potential is so full, I feel like I could fill up a couple other soldiers' potentials. God damn it. Mine is just the regular kind of full. And Donut, come on, man. This isn't you. You're supposed to be... You know, free-spirited. Not some kind of repressed, overachieving jarhead. One minute left. Dude, what, what fucking clock are you using? It's been like 15 seconds. Yeah, and what about me, blue guy? Am I supposed to be different too? You know, someone less nerdy and not lonely every second of the day? No, you're pretty much spot on, Simmons. Oh. Okay. Great. I've heard just about all I want out of this guy. I, I'm leaving, but just remember, this isn't the way things are meant to be. You know it, and I know it. Donut, you're a nice guy. You're not a jerk. Try expressing yourself a little bit, you know, like, start keeping a, uh, like a journal or a diary or something like that. <laughs> uh, a, a what? Never mind, never mind, I'm leaving, I'm leaving, I'm gonna live home now, okay? Ow, 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 ow. The nerve of that guy, he's just trying to get in our heads, right? How did he know about my diary? Your what? Nothing. I, I have to, <clears throat> I have to go log, log this in, in my logbook. Donut! Don't track mud in here! You know better! What do you think, Simmons? Hard to say, sir. He was talking nonsense, but he sounded so sure of himself. I think he should count himself lucky just to get out of this one alive. Incoming transmission. I got it. This is vehicle 479 are responding. Go for secure. Secure. Hello, Agent Carolina. Good morning, Phyllis. Nice to hear your voice. Is this a bad time? You sound occupied. The LZ got a little hot. We may be late to the rendezvous, but we'll get there. Don't leave without us. Understood. It sounds like the director was right to send you along to assist the team. Seems that way. Can't say everyone on board feels the same. All agents accounted for. Excellent work. Phyllis, I see a blank spot in the headcount. Please verify. We will see you at the rendezvous, Agent Carolina. Fly safe and have a nice day. Roger that. Carolina out. South, check our six. Heads up! We got company back here! <laughs>
Who are your friends? Just some people we met at the party. They seem nice. On it. Oh, what's that noise? They have missile lock. That's bad. Yes, that's bad. Hey, a basic maneuver! I'm trying. We'll try harder! Hey, Sal, do me a favor, would you? What? Thanks. You stupid bitch! Bleeding flare! Command is. Yes. Unless it's bad. 
In which case, I don't know what you're talking about. What? They aren't supposed to send anybody till after I die. We thought you were dead, dude. You walked into Red Base. Caboose, did they say who they were sending? Uh, uh, yes, they definitely did. Okay. Do you remember who they- No. God damn it. Hey, Griff. Griff. Stop right there, Simmons. What? Is it danger? The blues? No. You are not walking across my floor with those boots. I just mopped it. Griff, there's no time for this. Time for what, Simmons? A job well done? There's always time for that. I believe you know my motto. You don't have a motto. That's right, because there's always something more productive that I could be doing. Who has time to sit around making up mottos when they could be buffing the floor? Well, I need to get through. Sorry. You're just gonna have to wait five more minutes. It's not that long. Just do what I do. Count to three. A hundred times. Why wouldn't I just count to three hundred? Because doing things three times is fun. Turning off light switches, locking the door, turning off light switches... You said turning off light switches twice. You're right. I should probably say it a third time, just to make sure that no one I love dies. Turning off light switches? There. That feels better. Dude, you have issues. I also have a clean floor, which you can't walk on. But I need to get... Simmons! You know the rules, and what happens when we abandon the rules? Everybody gets germs and dies. Oh, silly me. I forgot the reason I came in here. Sarge wants you to take a break, Griff. You're on break right now. A break. Um, not familiar with the concept. Just stop working. Relax. Relax. Huh. Yeah, right. And how exactly would I go about doing that? Is there, like, a manual I could read or something? Just I... stop cleaning. Do nothing. What happened to Donut? He's in his bunk, reading that book he always reads. What book? Dunno. I don't ask. He doesn't tell. It's got flowers on it. Flowers? And drawings of things, like hearts. He likes to read it and cry. I'M NOT CRYING! Sarge needs your help, Donut. We're building a robot using that robot building kit Command sent us. I'm not really feeling up to it today. That blue guy have you depressed? You're bothered by what he said, aren't you? Maybe. Why did you listen to him? I didn't even know you had feelings, Donut. Well, I do, okay? Whatever. Come help us if you want. Up to you. Okay. I'll be out in a minute. I want to get my head together. Need to clean my weapon. Maybe light a few candles. Uh, candles really not the best light source for field stripping a pistol. Ugh, not everything is about function, Simmons. What did I say? Huh? What? I'm sorry, I wasn't listening. I was, I was kind of doing nothing. Looks like Donut got tracks all over your shiny floor, Griff. Yeah. Oh well. I'm on break anyway, right? Why should I give a fuck? Whoa. That felt really, really good to say that. Ugh, what is wrong with everyone? Man, I hate when things change. Change. The data you recovered has pinpointed the location of a very important target for Project Freelancer. Excellent work. Thank, Thank you, sir. Counselor, please update the board. That is all. Dismissed. I thought you said the mission was a success, sir. One of the mission objectives was stealth. Your carelessness revealed our intentions and made our next mission more difficult. They'll be ready for us. Dismissed. Think I should talk to her? Maybe we give her a minute. Okay, Caboose, think back. When you called command about the special forces person, what did they say to you? They said, this is command, we read you blue base. After that. Roger, over and out. Before that, somewhere between those two. Goodbye and hello are not the important parts of the conversation. No, I know, and my name isn't even Roger. Although that is a very cool name. I wonder if it fits. Roger, shut up. Roger, don't put that in your mouth. Roger, put that down. Roger, will you please be my best friend? Signed, Church. P.S. Your new name is the best. I like it. Signed, Church. Again. What did they tell you in the middle? What did they say? I need you to focus, Caboose. Oh, my... 
I need you to focus. Roger. Okay. They said that since one of our troops was hurt and since we are outnumbered, they would send us a special agent to help us recover. And they said that agent would be here... Yes. No, no. Not, not yes. When? When I was on the call with them. I mean the special agent. No, no. See, the operator said that. When? When I call command. How else would they tell me? Okay, stop, 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 stop. Let's just go through this step by step, okay? You called command. Yes. And they said they were sending a special agent. Yes. To our base. Yes. When did they say the special agent was coming? Uh, right before they gave me my new nickname. God damn it, Caboose! All right, just forget it! No, see, it's Roger now, remember? See, I know it can be confusing sometimes. Church, you have to keep up. Hey, Roger, what's wrong with Church? Oh, I don't know. He's having trouble understanding something. You know how he is with that. Wow, guys, your robot is looking great. Thanks. I didn't even know I was good with machines. You know what they say? Necessity is the mother of... Hey, Sarge, can I ask you about something? Sure, go ahead. Um, in private? Oh, sure, yeah, I get it. Don't want me around? That's fine, no big deal. I mean, you're not talking about me, right? <laughs> right? You're not talking about me? Be right back, Simmons. Sure you will. It's just what my dad said. What's up, Donut? Sarge, you ever have, you know, feelings and stuff? Feelings? Sure, all the time. Who doesn't? I just want to talk to someone about some thoughts I've been having. Thoughts? About life and stuff? Yeah. And you always seem so interested in the men and how we're doing. Well, that's my job. Lay it on me. I'm all ears. Sheila, turn on. Hey, uh, activate. Uh, uh, oh, Phyllis. Phyllis, I command you. Start. What the fuck are you doing? I'm trying to turn on the damn tank. By yelling at it? Why don't you just use a key? You have keys for the tank? Nah, they didn't send them. Okay, right, thanks. You're a big help. Me? I'm not the one yelling at the tank. Hey, the TV is on the fritz, too. You want to come inside and yell at it? Maybe you can insult its mother or something. I need to get the tank running before Tex shows up. Right. The secret agent who also just happens to be your girlfriend. It's complicated. And you think if you have a tank, that's going to impress her. No, I need it to defend us in case things get a little out of hand with her. Like I said... It's complicated? Yeah, it's complicated. I had a girlfriend once. Nobody cares. I met her on the internet. Oh man, your girlfriend was a dude. Her name was Amelia. She would send me letters all the time. Sounds high maintenance. Letters from my family. Letters about stuff I ordered online. Even about investment opportunities in other countries. What? Dude, I don't think your girlfriend's name was Amelia. I think it was email. I'm pretty sure you fell in love with your email. She was always there for me. Until I forgot our special word. You mean your password. She never forgave me. Well, then I guess you should have made out with her sister, Voice Amelia. Oh, she talked too much. It's always blinked at me. Come oh, on, you stupid tank. Just start. Dude, give it up. Stop working on the tank. You can't pick up chicks in a tank anyway. What? Actually, now that I say it out loud, I guess you could pick up chicks in a tank. Well, I could. You can't. So stop messing with it. I have to do something. You want to impress your girl? Just listen to me. School's in session. About to start the master class. Professor Fuck, that's me. Are Sergeant Donut still talking up there? Yeah, it's been a few hours. Maybe I should see if they want anything to eat. And don't even get me started on the design of the new armor. The lines are all wrong. And the color palette? I mean, what is this? Autumn? Am I right? But let's save that for another day. Yeah. Well, thanks for the talk, Sarge. So, uh, what were you guys talking about? Lots of things. Feelings, mostly. That was a long talk. Yes, it was. Seems like a lot of feelings. Yes, it is. Well, if there's anyone the troops can confide in, it's you, Sarge. Simmons, I'm going to be honest with you. I think you might have used all that up. But you still have some time for me, right? I have some thoughts I've been wanting to get off my chest. Why don't we just get back to work? Back to work after our heartfelt discussion. Right, sir? You know what I'm thinking, Simmons? Let's just put a pin in that discussion. A pin? Or a nail. Nails last longer. Or one of them railroad spikes. Tell you what, let's abandon the pen metaphor altogether. Let's just take your idea, put it in a box, wrap that box in chains, then cover the whole thing with cement and throw it in the ocean. I'll just get back to work, sir. Now that idea I like. Greetings, fellow web surfer. Be sure to subscribe to our channel before you go. It'll be just like we're friends. Not that I need friends. <laughs> Please don't go. It wasn't your fault, Connie. 
Easy for you to say. He didn't drop the ball. The ball got dropped. We were all there. It's everyone's responsibility. Damn it. Why are you doing that? What am I doing? Making excuses for me. I'm not making excuses for myself. Why are you? I'm trying to make you feel better. Yeah? Great. Hey, why don't you go make Carolina feel better? Go pat Maine on the head. See how that works out for you. We all make mistakes. No! We don't. That's the point. We don't all make mistakes. Some of us very specifically make mistakes, and others don't seem to make any mistakes at all. Connie, come on. That's why they're doing all this. These missions, the rankings, they're drawing a line between us, Wash. And you're either on one side of that line, or you're on the other. And it's getting pretty goddamn clear which side I'm on. No one thinks like that. We're a team. I'm not talking about you guys. I mean them. Him. The director? He's given us everything. He's helping us. Helping us? Wake up. Wake the fuck up. He's filtering us. This is a selection process, Wash. I don't know for what, but if you're not at the top of that board, you're not worth anything to him. You're just overreacting. You've always been hard on yourself, Connie. Not as hard as they are. Not nearly as hard as they're going to be. Don't call me Connie. Makes me sound like a fucking kid. Call me CT. Oh, and that line that I talked about? You better hurry up and figure out what side you're on, Agent Washington, before they figure it out for you. All right, class is in session. Students, line up over here. Teacher on this side. I'm not doing this. Dude, you've got a girl coming over. You don't know what to say to her. You need my help. And the first set of lessons is free. How are you qualified to teach us this stuff? Are you kidding me? No. No, I'm not kidding. How are you qualified? You talk about girls all the time. I've never seen you with one. I'm... I have lots of... Okay, just shut up and listen. Stay quiet and hold all your questions to the end. Now, before we start, does anyone have any questions? Ah, uh, yes. I would like to... Aha! That was a trick question. You're supposed to hold all questions till the end. Oh, yeah? Why didn't you hold your trick question until the end, then? The rules don't apply to me. Well, maybe my question was the... magic question, too. Yeah, abracadabra. You're an idiot. So, we've already learned our first lesson. The rules don't apply to you. Girls like a rebel. Someone outside the law. Like a criminal? Mm, it depends on the crime. Nothing with animals. See, they want someone with a free and independent spirit. Something that they can crush into a raw material that can then be molded into what they really want. What do they really want? They don't know, which is why you have to tell them what they want, without actually telling them what to do. That sounds hard. That's why we're doing lessons. Uh, Should I I be taking notes? Do you even know how to write? Is that another trick question? Can I answer it at the end? Getting bored here. Okay, then let's do some role-playing. I'll give you critiques on your approach. Role-playing? Yeah. Caboose, you play the girl. You want Caboose to be the woman? Dude, it's a lot bigger stretch for you to play a man, trust me. Uh, uh, okay, what should I say? Just say whatever a girl would say. Uh, okay, uh... I, uh, I just really want to meet someone nice, uh, you know, someone who appreciates me for who I am. Not so much because I'm pretty, but because they really want to get to know me because they want to find out what my interests are. And then we can spend time exploring the world together and sharing all the wonderful things in life that make it wonderful. What? Do you know girls at all? Talk about how much you like shoes. Yeah, and about reality TV shows. Here, church, you start. Just hit on Caboose. Caboose, act like you like church. I've been preparing for this role my whole life. Shut up. Okay, church, your girlfriend just got to base. You see her, and you say, Uh, hey. Hey there. Hello. Giggle. Blinking eyelashes. Puppy. I can't, I'm, all right, I'm out. I can't do this. Don't be a baby. Caboose, stop making sound effects. You're a girl now. Girls can't make sound effects. Quietly angry. And stop narrating. Okay. Fine. There you go. That's it. That's a girl. Okay, church, hit it. Action. Uh, uh, hey, uh, what are you doing? What's up? Uh, uh, what's up with what you're doing? Smooth. Caboose? <clears throat> okay, uh, yeah, yet, I was just sitting here thinking about shoes and celebrities that only have first name. Perfect. Actually, if you want the truth, I feel like I have to say these things to make myself more appealing when I really think that I should just stop it. Okay, sorry. Okay, sorry. Church, say something rebellious. Uh, okay, I think the working class should uprise against the... Rich people. I said rebellious, not revolutionary. Oh, okay. I drive a fast car over the speed limit all the time. I will go with you anywhere. See? It's easy. Where am I? Oh, well, that looks nice.
Oh my god! A giant person!
Just hit subscribe to put it to use. You're supposed to convince them to subscribe, not put them to sleep. You loser. <sighs> I hate him so much. Estos terremotos parecen estar embaranado. Good point, Lopez. I don't understand what you said, but you presented it in such a confident manner that it must be right. Man, that new robot really seems to be fitting in around here. Yeah, I noticed. He's pretty popular. Awesome. Yeah, even though no one understands him, people seem to really want to get past the rough robotic exterior and get to know the inner Lopez. So happy for him. Me too. Wait. Was that sarcastic? Yeah, dude, I have to admit, that one was off the charts even from my sarcastic meter. He notado un patrón en la activada sismisa. Se necesita mes estudio. <laughs> oh, good one, Lopez. Man, you are a riot. No, usted no me entiende. <laughs> Man, all that and the guy's a comedian. God, I wish my sidekick could be funny like that. What's your problem, Simmons? What? You don't even know what he said. How could it be funny? Whatever. I guess you just had to be there. I was right here. Tengo acceso a los siguientes equipos. Sismografo. Sismografo avanzada. All right, nice chatting with you, Lopez. Now enough jokes. Get back to work polishing stuff. The stuff's not going to polish itself, you know. Aquí todo el mundo está en peligro. Tienes que escucharme. <laughs> well, okay, one last joke. Well, that was it. Now, seriously, back to work. <laughs> I just got that one, too. Boy, he really makes you think. It's like he's saying what we're all thinking, but in Spanish. You guys are idiots. I'll show you who's likable and funny, and who people like. Huh, what's wrong with Simmons? Huh? No, I don't care. Hey, Donut, let's go hang out with Lopez. Great idea. I'll show them. Yeah, I'll show them good. Yeah, okay, okay. It's like when a computer tries to solve a problem. Do you know what recursion is? Yeah, I, I love that movie. No, no, it's like it's like a thing where a computer tries a number of different iterations to solve a problem. Then when it gets to the end, it returns all those solutions back up the line to the first iteration, and then it has its solution. Does that make sense? You're saying you're a computer. No, 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 no. Actually, well, actually, yes. Yeah, sort of. I'm actually, I am a computer, kind of. I'm a computer program. But your foot was bleeding. And your breath kind of stinks. You know, I... I wasn't going to say anything before, but, you know, since we're all telling the truth about each other... Caboose, you're an idiot. Well, I didn't realize how much words could hurt until it was my turn. I don't think I want to play this honesty game anymore. No, I I'm a real person in here because this is all constructed by memories of the person that I'm based on. Same as me. I'm all the memories of that guy. Who is that? It's another program called Alpha, who was kind of a dick. And he was based on a guy named the Director. Who is also kind of a dick. Well, I can see you're continuing a grand tradition. Yeah, I'm very proud. It's quite a lineage. I grew up on a boat. Nobody, Nobody cares. cares. You're all just jealous. And this girl who's coming is that original guy's girlfriend. Yeah, I think. I don't remember exactly. I thought you were that guy's memory. No, I mean other guy's memory. The middle one. Did he have a girlfriend? No. Wait. Maybe. Dude, I don't know how any of you got any girlfriends spouting all this sci-fi bullshit. You guys ever talk about football, for God's sake? Look. I just know I'm supposed to meet this girl, and I'm supposed to fall in love. Uh-huh. And then what happened? I don't know. We, we do whatever people do when they fall in love. I'm asking you a specific question. You should give me a specific answer. Are you taking notes? No. Wait, wait. My job is to solve this problem or pass it along. That's it. So you follow this girl down through the levels of the memory iterations, and you basically try to figure out how to make things work. Even though she doesn't like you. She likes me, she's just, you know... Me. Yeah, thanks, Caboose. She's me. Yeah, it was an easy guess. You know, because all girls are pretty much me. Can I just say, this might be the creepiest stalker scenario I've ever heard. And I've made a few myself. What? You chase a dead girl through a memory, and every time she escapes you, you either follow her down to the next set of memories, or resurrect her in some way. Only to do it all over again. That's not stalkerish, that's romantic. You know what the difference between stalking and romance is? Romance happens in movies. In real life, it's called stalking. Well, maybe all of this is happening inside of a movie. Pfft. Oh, please. Who the fuck would watch that movie? All we ever do is stand around and talk. Hey, you dropped a grenade. That's not mine. Caboose, pick that up. I'm not allowed to carry grenades, remember? Because of that one exploding time? Which was no one's fault. Well, I didn't drop it. Tucker, count yours. I have a readout on my helmet, dummy. I don't need to count. Oh, right. Well, it has to be somebody's. Fuck. Somebody threw a grenade at us, didn't they? Yeah, we probably should have figured that out sooner, right? Hey, Wash, wait up. 
Listen, I heard you had a meeting with internals. Oh, you did? Yeah, do you mind if I ask what it was about? <clears throat> Not really supposed to talk about that. Help me out here. I'm still getting heat about using equipment in the field. You did? Really? Without a pipeline back to the command server? I had to improvise. We had a problem. Let me guess. Are you related to the problem? Okay, now I don't want to talk about it. Equipment in the field. Now, don't forget what happened to Utah during training. You're lucky it didn't kill you. If I was lucky, I wouldn't have needed to use it at all. Well, you can relax. Internals didn't ask about you. It was something else. Lots of questions about the insurrection and transmissions coming out of our... Oh, sorry, sir. Hey, what's going on? Soldier, where is everybody running? New agents are squaring off against Maine, Wyoming, and York on the training room floor. We're going to watch. Hey, guys, wait up. Three on one? <laughs> I gotta see this. Yeah, right behind you. What's up, Forever Alone? So, uh, you want to do something with your life, or you just want to sit around on your ass all day like a loser? Yeah, me too. So, uh, just subscribe and keep watching YouTube. It's way easier. Hey, Wash, wait up. Listen, I heard you had a meeting with internals. Oh, you did? Yeah, do you mind if I ask what it was about? <clears throat> Not really supposed to talk about that. Help me out here. I'm still getting heat about using equipment in the field. You did? Really? Without a pipeline back to the command server? I had to improvise. We had a problem. Let me guess. Are you related to the problem? Okay, now I don't want to talk about it. Equipment in the field. Now, don't forget what happened to Utah during training. You're lucky it didn't kill you. If I was lucky, I wouldn't have needed to use it at all. Well, you can relax. Internals didn't ask about you. It was something else. Lots of questions about the insurrection and transmissions coming out of our... Oh, sorry, sir. Hey, what's going on? Soldier, where is everybody running? New agents are squaring off against Maine, Wyoming, and York on the training room floor. We're going to watch. You guys wait up. Three on one? <laughs> I gotta see this. Three, yeah, right behind two, you. One. Round begins. What's going on down there? There's no training sessions on the schedule. It's impromptu. Who the hell is that? Some new recruit. sure doesn't move like he's a recruit. Why do you assume it's a guy? She's a girl. Oh, I didn't really mean that he... I, I mean it... <laughs> I, I mean her... I... <laughs> right. Sorry. Just shut up. Both of you, <laughs> can it? Sounds like someone might be a little concerned about their position. Hey, South, pay attention. You might actually learn something if you stop running your mouth for a minute. Round one, over. Pugil sticks training complete. Point awarded to Texas. The current score is team one. Zero Texas, points. huh? I thought Texas, that name was reserved. Nice moves. Could be luck. We'll see. Beginning hand-to-hand -hand combat. Round two in five, four, three, two, one. Round begin. Okay, guys. This one should be easy. So let's just play it by the book. Maine. How about you flank left and then... Or you could just charge in and get immobilized first. Okay, Wyoming, let's stick together and... What's the story? Am I the only one on this team that knows how to talk? I don't think talking's your problem. Oh no! Wow! Okay, that was pretty impressive. Okay, guys, that obviously didn't work so well. About this time we stay in formation, and instead of like, damn it, can't believe I actually volunteered for this crap. Point Texas. 
Crisis. Hand-to-hand -hand combat complete. Now resetting the floor for lockdown paint scenario. Ugh, I hate that paint. Tell me about it. it stings like a bitch. It turns your armor hard as a rock. I wouldn't know. It's not bad if you don't let it hit you. Thanks. I'll try to remember that. Round three in five, four, three, two, one. Round begin. Bane! Bane! Look, I'm gonna move left. You go. Or you just run out, do whatever you want, and then get killed. Ready? Break. Good job, everybody. Oh, man, it's gonna be a long day.
Rebel Team en route. Please remain York! Calm. York! Get over here now! Is he gonna be okay? Come on, York. Hang in there. Can't believe she did that to him. Get off me. Shot his armor, sacrificed him? Lockdown hardens the armor. She probably saved his life. Quick thinking. Yeah. Really quick. Everyone, stand down! Now! You should be ashamed of yourselves. I expect you to act as a team. They use live ammunition on the floor, sir. That's against regulations. Do you think our enemies will care about regulations on the battlefield, Agent Washington? So, you're not punishing them? Ingenuity and adaptability are <sighs> admirable traits. You should all learn something from this. Dismissed. <laughs> yeah. We should learn something, all right. I can't believe this. Don't forget to check your place on that list, Wash. Don't touch me. Interesting. Take me back to the point. Ah, what the hell was that? I can't see anything. Tucker, where are you? Caboose, are you dead? I hope so. Ah, what was that? I think it was a flashbang. I can't see. What? Well, it's a good name because it definitely went flash and bang. What? Oh, my God. Are we under attack? Is it the wrench? I don't know. I can't see anything either. My mother always said I would go blind, but for a totally different reason. What? Caboose, stop saying what you can't hear. Can't a fear. But this is not the time. You're deaf. Oh, no. I had so much to live for. No, you didn't. What was that? Something just hit me. Something just hit me, too. Is it another grenade? We're under attack. Open fire. Ah, get some. Take that, fucker. Que la gente de Miriard de Jor que me investigue este fulmuero sismizo. Yeah, okay, buddy, whatever you say. Hey, you missed a spot. Por lo menos todos vamos a morir con un vigilo limpio. <laughs> you said it. Now come on, chop chop. Back to work, buddy. Let's hear the less talk I don't understand and see more work I don't want to do. How's it going out here? Great. The Jeep has never been so clean. That's because you're not the one cleaning it. Good point. You know, Sarge, all this time, the laziness in me, it's been really underutilized. I never reached my full potential. I just realized I should be in management. You do seem like a natural. It's the best job ever. You just tell people what to do, and they do it. And if you don't have anything for them to do, you just tell them to do something they did before, but do it better this time. I've got it all figured out. How about you get busy helping with that Jeep, then? I'm sorry, what? I'm on break. Come in, Lopez. Lopez, come in. This is a secure channel, Lule. This is Flying Eagle. I have a secret mission for you. Bueno de la guía. Actually, it's Simmons. We're using code names on this mission, Lopez. Because it's top secret. Porque no puedo obtener un nombre un clave. I need you to come to the cave and investigate something. It's top secret. Don't tell Sarge or Griff or Donut. Or anyone else I didn't mention. Usted podría tener solo dijo. No le digas a nadie. Okay. See you in the cave. Come alone and unarmed. You can also come in with your eyes closed if you want. For secrets. Esto para se sospechoso. También mi ojo se apagara. Yes, it is an honor to be selected. You are right. Flying Eagle. Out. Porque me envían a esta unidad. Vuelo de Aguila está aquí. Down here, Lopez! This is the perfect plan. Lopez will walk into the water, which I've electrified using A, this battery, and B, my incredible knowledge of how batteries work. The resulting shock will short him out, and all the guys will see that I'm the funny smart one who's good at math and not having emotions. They'll see. Hola. Oh, hi, Lopez. I was just down here investigating our mission. Hey, why don't you come over here, through that big puddle? No, le he oído decir que electrifada que no tengo ni idea por qué los humanos necesitan para hablar voz alta cuando piensen. Come on, over here. No, usted está tratando de daños. Seriously, this way. Just walk into that puddle. I mean, the regular puddle. The one that's not, you know, you know what? Just forget I mentioned the puddle. 
No puddle there. That's dry. Optical illusion. Que son muy malos en esto. Please, come on! Me limitar a dar la vuelta. Veo de otra manera. What? No! Wait! Dios mío. Dame un respiro. Hello, everyone. Now that we have our own YouTube channel, I've taken the liberty of reorganizing everything for a streamlined viewing experience. Just hit subscribe to put it to use. You're supposed to convince them to subscribe, not put them to sleep, you loser. <sighs> I hate him so much. Oh, what happened? Hola. What? Am I dead? I see my body. Am I in heaven? Estoy tomando su lugar el equipo rojo. Oh, why is my body speaking Spanish? Oh no. Did I go to Mexican heaven by mistake? That's like white people hell. No. Reemplazar usted es la única manera de que un puedo tener acceso el equipo. I knew it! You just wanted to become super popular so you could take my place. Yo no tendría que ser super popular para hacer que... You're gonna regret this, Lopez. No veo como... We'll all regret this! Que ni siquiera tiene sentido. I still don't understand. How does more breaks make us more efficient? It's simple. If we have less hours to do work, we get more done in less time. It's all ratios. Hola. Sons, where in Sam hell have you been? Cueva. Estudio. You sound weird. Yeah. Almost like you're speaking a foreign language. But you're speaking very slowly and clearly. So I understand what he means. Me too. What have you been up to? Las cosas humans como de costumbre yunar y tener problemas de matemáticas mal sin razón alguna. Sounds boring. I didn't understand that one. Me neither. But boring is always a safe bet with Simmons. Good point. Le recuerdo mi disculpe. Tengo que ver algunos equipos. Okay. Bye, Simmons. Good luck on whatever you're doing. Gracias. Oh, man. Instead of a big white blur, now everything's just a big black blur. Man, my head should only hurt this much if I had a lot more fun the night before. What? Ow, Caboose, stop yelling. Someone give me an aspirin. You guys are babies. Babies? You chucked a grenade at us, you stupid bitch. What do you expect? Hey, there's a big difference between a flashbang and a grenade. It doesn't seem like it. Well, if I threw a grenade at you, I wouldn't have to have this stupid conversation right now. I would just be stepping over some disgusting puddles. This is your girlfriend, I take it? Oh, yeah. Tucker, text, text, Tucker. There you go. Sup? Hello. Are people meeting other people? I want to meet people. No, you don't. And stop yelling. Nice to meet you, Mr. Yelling! Yeah, why would you attack us? Weren't you coming all the way out here to help us? Hey, I needed to evaluate the situation. I heard someone was dead. I show up here, and three idiots are standing around arguing. I'm not walking into that blind. So you made us blind. Oh, boo-hoo. It's non-lethal. So what? That's what? Is that supposed to make us feel better? A kick in the balls would be non-lethal, too. That depends on who does the kicking. Is that a threat? <laughs> How about we just call it an experiment? See what happens. How about we agree to disagree? Good idea. So... Who's dead? Oh, nobody. We just made a mistake. We thought... Uh, we thought we should bury our dead teammate and then take his name off the roster so that no one could prove he was never here. We did? Yes, because that's what she is here to investigate, Tucker. And if that guy didn't exist, why would she stick around? Oh, right. Yeah, I thought you meant some other non-existent guy who didn't die. Not the one guy who did die. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? Why did you remove him from the roster? Uh, I don't know. Seemed appropriate at the time. You know, it's like a respect thing. What was his name? Anderson Smith. Well, was it Anderson or Smith? Uh, Ander Smith. Private Ander Smith. Ander Smith? Oh, Mr. Ander Smith! I'll always miss you. You were too young to die. Yeah, he was like ten seconds old. Shut up, Tucker. Hey, Griff. Have you seen Simmons? Yeah, we're working on some equipment together. Together? Yeah, he went up the hill, he said he needed my help, so I said, no problem, I'll be there in a few minutes. When was that? About five hours ago. Oh, so how is the project going? Well, he hasn't asked for help again, which means I haven't had to think of a new excuse, so I'd say it's going great. What's he doing? I don't know, he's got some new toys or something up there, I guess he's testing them out. Toys? Yeah. Toys is a broad term, Griff. It can mean a lot of things. Gadgets. Go on. Electronic devices. I think I'll go check this out for myself. You do that. If I could just wriggle free a little, maybe I could...
loosen this. There, I'm free. Now to take my place on Red Team again. Man, Lopez was right. I do say my thoughts out loud a lot. I wonder why I do that. I'm still doing it. I really should try to stop. Okay, that was the last one. Hey, I did it. No, I'm... Man, do you read me? This is Freelancer Tex reporting in. Roger that, senorita. We read you loud and clarita. How you doing? Okay, I just need to make sure she sticks around for a little while. You know, so I can talk to her a little bit more. And investigating this dead guy is going to be a good distraction It doesn't for bother you that you made up a guy out of nowhere and then killed that guy just to have a chance to talk to your girlfriend. No, no, no. It's like a net... Uh, whatever you call it. It's even. You know, he didn't exist before and he doesn't exist now. No harm, no foul. Right? Dude, you seriously got to look into this stalker thing. I miss him. You miss who? Major Smith. He's a reminder of how close we all are just to not being here one day. He wasn't here any days, idiot. He doesn't exist. Oh, how can you say that? Don't you believe in the afterlife? What? Afterlife implies life at some point. He didn't have one. Because he was so young. He had hopes and dreams. He was a dream. Yes, he was. To all of us who knew him. Okay, I'm actually less worried about you now, and I'm more worried about Caboose. Caboose, he didn't exist. You never knew anyone named Ander Smith. None of us did. Denial is an important stage in Green Bay. Yeah, apparently denial is an important part of reality, too. Yeah, take it from the guy who calls that chick his girlfriend. Roger that. Over and out, command. Oh, shit. She's done with her call. Quick, uh, talk about something else. Um, like what? Anything, anything. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, you know what? I think you're right, Tucker. Cows can't talk. But maybe they can't talk because just no one ever taught them how to do that. Right? That might have been the worst ad-lib ever. You just blew my mind with the cow thing. That ain't hard, dude. All right, here's the deal. I'm going to stick around until we get this dead guy thing solved. Oh, really? Well, that's great. Isn't that perfect, Tucker? Don't gloat. It's Miss Gary. I have a question. Um, how are we going to fix the dead guy being dead? Oh, we're not. We're going to even the teams. Come on, let's go up the hill and kill one of the Reds. Then I can get out of this mud puddle. Oh. Hey. I'll even let you pick which one. Come on, let's go. Well, this sounds like... fun? Let's pack a picnic. We could always just eat the red we kill. Hey, Church, pick the fat guy. Where am I? Oh, well, that looks nice. Oh, my God! A giant person! Okay, well, I just ran everything again. All calculations are up to date, taking into account standard delays for communication and response time. Our window looks good. I agree. Well, you should. I'm sure you'd make the same calculations I did, just, you know, more slowly. Arrogance is a rather unbecoming trait, Alpha. Are you seriously giving me a lecture on arrogance right now? <laughs> Heads up, you got a visitor. Director? Log off. Yeah, yeah, way ahead of you. Yes, Agent Carolina. The team is ready, sir. Excellent. Let us begin. Agents, your mission today is by far the most important you have undertaken to date. As our number one, Carolina will be leading from the field. Okay, here's what we have. As you may have heard, there is suspected insurrection activity in this area. Our intel says that members of the UNSC loyal to the insurrection have acquired a high-level asset and are holding it in this secure location. It's a 110-story building in the middle of an urban environment. What does security look like? They have enough troops to fill a 110-story building. So, that's a lot of security. We're up to it. Our job is to infiltrate the building, work our way up to the floor where the sarcophagus is being held, and secure it. The sarcophagus? That is what we are calling the primary objective. But since this is a high-level asset, we need to access a key code to open the sarcophagus. I'm guessing they don't keep that just taped to the side. It's held by an official of the program who will be moving in a vehicle along the freeway between inspections. That's when we'll hit the facility. We need to acquire both targets within minutes of each other. If we fail that, the remaining target will enter lockdown and we miss our window. We will not have another chance at this. So that means two teams. Two teams. Team A will consist of me, Wash, and Maine. We will work infiltration on the package's storage facility. York is still in the infirmary, so Wash, you will have to pull lockpicking duty. Um, okay. Guess I'll reread my field manual in the transport. Hey, don't be so quick to give away my job. York? I thought you were in the hospital. According to their records, I am. How's your eye? It's okay. Docs are letting me out tomorrow. Tomorrow, huh? 
Look, I couldn't let you guys have all the fun without me. Besides, you need someone to get you in. Listen, I'm happy to see him too, but this mission, I don't know... Hey, if York says he's good, then he's good. It's your call, boss. You're good, right? Okay, look, I said I was okay. Good might be overselling it a little. It's settled then. York will join Team A and get them in the facility. Thank you, sir. Transport will be two lightly equipped Pelican dropships. We're rigged for fast running only people, no heavy armaments. Team B will be North, Wyoming, and CT. You will act as recon for Team A, and once we enter the building, you will disengage to attack the target on the freeway. North will lead Team B. Got it. What about Agent South? Agent South will not be accompanying you on this mission. Hmm. I guess the world's a tough place when you move down a rank. And where's our new recruit? Will she be joining us? That's enough questions, Connecticut. Notice he didn't say no. Team B should be simple. Stop the vehicle and grab the case. Team A, you have more of a challenge. Mainly, the sarcophagus is an unknown. How unknown are we talking? Unknown in that we don't know its size or its weight or its dimensions. We just know it will have these markings somewhere on the exterior. I saw those same markings on the oil platform. Correct. That facility created the primary objective. Do we know what's inside it? Yes, we know. How do we know what's in it, but not know how big it is? Sorry, sir. We have a job to do, people. Let's do it right and come home safe. That is all. You are dismissed. Yes, Yes, sir. sir. Fellow web surfer, be sure to subscribe to our channel before you go. It'll be just like we're friends. Not that I need friends. <laughs> Please don't go. Okay, pick one. Anyone? Well, preferably one on that side of the canyon. But, uh, I'm not all that choosy. Why are you looking at me when you say that? No reason. Just pick one to take the shot. I'll cover you if they attack. You mean, shoot them with this? What else? Uh, he's really not that great with that thing. Give me a break. You're a soldier. Yeah, well, that's debatable. Hit the rock over there. Okay. Ugh. Yeah, see, I think the sun reflected off the rock face there. And... Just give me the damn rifle. Yeah, okay, thanks. Hey, Simmons, did you hear that? See, so naba como un rifle. I'm sure it's nothing. Por qué dices eso? Esta es una guerra. Good point, Simmons. Back to work. Dude, this has to be embarrassing for you. I don't really want to talk about it. All right, come on. It's not that hard. Which one should we take out? The pink one? The orange one? Pretty sure he's yellow. Is it me, or does he seem a little slow? Yeah, Caboose was held back a grade, or two. I meant the orange one. Oh, yeah, he's just fat. What about the red one? I mean, he's the leader? He seems tough. Or maybe the maroon one. He looks like he's up to something. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I can't really decide which one. Maybe we should put it to a vote. You know what? Screw it. The maroon one is closest. We'll just shoot him. Ow. Nice shot. Thanks. Mierda. Oh my god! Simmons! How did this happen? Wow. That was pretty fucking brutal. Andrew Smith, I get my promise. You have been avenged. You know what? Let me shoot another one. I think you guys could use the advantage. Um, are you you sure? There was so much we had left to talk about. Like our feelings and hopes and dreams. And why most of your insides are wires. How could you just explode like this? We could have talked. You could have told me what was wrong. Uh, Maybe I'll let that one live. Might demoralize the rest of them. Good idea. Come on, let's pack it in. Does anyone else feel really, really dirty about this? And not the good kind of really, really dirty? Team A, you look clear. Window is open. Start your clocks. On my mark, mark. Sync. Roger that. Team A is moving. Copy that, Carolina. Good luck, teammate. Thanks. We won't need it. All right, Bravo, let's move out. We have three minutes until first alert. Let's have our target in hand by two.
We're in. York, get up here. How long to crack that lock? Should take about 60 seconds. You can give me 15. Wow. Is that holographic? That's high end. Can you get through it? Of course I can. You didn't bring me along for my good looks, did you? Whoever designed this is a genius. You were saying? Okay, I take it back. Whoever designed this is an asshole. Damn. Everybody in. Thanks, York. But do something about that alarm system. We don't need any more surprises. Does saying sorry count as something? Mm, guess not. We'll secure the package. Set some trackers and then find us a way out of this. Moving. What the? Looks like we got an alert on Sector 7. That's the vault. Take a team up there now. Simmons is dead? I can't believe he's gone. Well, you know what they say at a time like this. He may be dead, but he's never truly gone. Until we get rid of all his gross body parts. Griff, go fetch a garbage pail. Sarge, I'm grieving here. Can't making up excuses to avoid work wait till later. You're right, Griff. I suppose someone should say a few words. Anybody? Come on, who knew him best? Donut? Um... I think he said he liked gum once. I don't know. That's kind of all I got. How about you, Griff? Me? Why me? Come on! Griff and Simmons! You guys were inseparable. Surely the two of you must have gotten to know each other over the years. Yeah, I don't know. He would talk a lot and I'd lose interest immediately. And then he would ask me a question and I would just go, Huh? What? Oh yeah, sure, Simmons. Whatever you say. It wasn't a perfect system. But it was ours. But he always stayed by your side. Isn't there anything you remember him telling you? Huh? Oh, uh, yeah. Sure, Sarge. Whatever. What about you, sir? Simmons always loved helping you. He did have a knack for following orders. Sometimes I'd make things up just to get him off my back. One time I told him to disassemble the Jeep and rebuild it. Just to keep him busy. <laughs> I'll miss doing that. Guys, guys, I'm free. Oh, wow. You already killed Lopez. Awesome. Can it, Simmons? We're trying to give your eulogy. But I'm not dead, I'm... Wait, you guys are talking about me? In a good way? Oh, never mind. Go ahead. Please, continue. <clears throat> Gentlemen, we're here to pay our last respects to Simmons, who died so suddenly and so violently. Oh, man, this is the best day ever. Simmons wore maroon armor. He talked a lot and did some work. Also, he liked to come. The end. What? That's it? That's my funeral? Not quite. Let's get that garbage pail. I remembered the gum thing. I never imagined that my death could somehow be worse than my life, but here it is. Bitchin'. I contributed to the talks a lot part. I don't talk a lot. I talk a regular amount. Do you really think I talk a lot? Huh? Oh, yeah. Sure, Simmons. Whatever. I hate you. Oh, man. I just realized I could have made a flower arrangement for the funeral. <sighs> There's just so few chances to do that around here. Don't worry, Donut. I'm sure one of us will get killed again soon. Uh, you're just trying to make me feel better. And I'd love that about you. What's up, Forever Alone? So, uh, you want to do something with your life, or you just want to sit around on your ass all day like a loser? Yeah, me too. So, uh, just subscribe and keep watching YouTube. It's way easier. Alright, everyone, spread out. What we need is here somewhere. It's probably something small, easy to miss. Take as many scans as possible. There may be other things here we can use. That's a good look. Carolina, motion trackers indicate you got an enemy team outside the door. Well, let's hope they're not as good at picking locks as you are, York. All right, team. We're about to have company. Boss, I have good news and bad news. Hit me. We found the markings we're looking for. The bad news is they're on that. That? Team A, I got us an exit up here. Straight up the stairwell, door to the roof, helipad. Copy. All radio air support. Now, how are we going to get that thing up to the roof? York, I saw a window washing unit when we came into the facility. Can you find where it attaches to the building? Oh no, that's a tough one. Let me see what I can do. What are you up to? Improvising. Come here, Maine. Improvising? I hate it when we do that. Better hurry! Maine, this should work fine. You're the only one heavy enough to counterbalance. Oh, don't be a baby. Ah. 
Hey, did you hear that noise? Probably the sound of you being an idiot. Oh, you're probably right. Dick biscuit. Package is here. Stop right there, or we'll shoot. We're, we're gonna need bigger handcuffs. Is that, is that a knife? Rifle? Knife? Ah! Well, that ought to buy us some time. I almost feel bad for the people down there. Don't. What? I said almost. If I may, Director, I think it would be wise if we- Shut up, Counselor. Of course, sir. What the hell? There were four of them here! What the fuck is going on? What did I say? I said one thing! Keep them in front of me! Hey, man. You mind holding this for me for a second? Well, thank you. Fire. Firing main cannon. Oh, son of a
on this chase. Ooh, my heels, Come on. Move my wheels, Come on. I'm not Stay trying to get killed. Ooh, what I'm gonna do? Me and the crew, one false move, we threw. Just level high, it's full court press. Can't guess wrong, the result is death. A girl can feel like a kid need middle and gotta get away from this bullshit. Middleman push to the max. Relax, cause if we ain't swift, we facing the ass. Oh, yeah, sure. No problem. Maybe you and your girlfriend could find time to go on a killing spree. Do some real bonding. Tucker! Oh, that's right. Not your girlfriend. Just the girl that you're stalking through multiple planes of existence. Ugh. Romantically. Please, I just need a little more time! Why? Who cares? I do! I'm supposed to do this! Fine. Where is she now? She's talking with Caboose. Well, that should keep her busy for at least a few minutes. Half an hour if she starts asking him math problems. Hey, I'm gonna stick around a while longer. You are? I mean, you are? Yeah. Caboose here said you guys need some help with the tank, so I figured uh, I could help with that, too. What can I say? I like the kid. Plus, I paid her $100. Yeah, that, too. Money? Why didn't I think of that? Because you don't have any money? Good point. Hey, Caboose, give me some money. Okay, wait. Is this a trick? I'll pay you $100 to show me how it works. I can't believe you guys didn't know this was Lopez and not me. What do you expect? He had the perfect disguise. He painted himself maroon. Badly. Exactly. How could anyone be expected to see through that? He spoke Spanish. No one else does. That did seem weird at first, but you always go through those annoying phases. Like, remember that time you were going to learn to play banjo? Or the time you were going to be a vegan? What do you mean, phases? I am a vegan. And I can play the banjo. I know, and isn't all that annoying? But you couldn't figure it out. <sighs> you don't know me at all. To be fair, we didn't know Lopez either. We knew you both equally as little, so you can see how we'd get confused. Also... We didn't really care. Yeah, but Lopez was here a day. I've been here for years. You have? See, I'm learning new stuff about you already. Now the next time an evil robot tries to take your place, I'll have questions to ask it. Shut up. Why the hell am I the one cleaning up my own body? This is insulting. Hey, what do you think he was using all this equipment for? I don't know, boring stuff? Who cares? Hmm. Oh, wait, I forgot. You like boring stuff. Never mind what I said. I'm sure it's something for sports. It looks like we have a mystery to solve. What are you, 12? <laughs> Hey, uh, hey, you got a second? Sure. What do you want to talk about? No, not you, Caboose. I want to talk to Tex. Oh, go ahead. I want to talk to her alone. You can't talk to someone alone. There has to be two people. Those are the rules. I don't make them by myself. Well, I, I suppose she could stand really far away, and then you could yell. That might, that might work. Caboose, I would like for you to leave. Oh, I... I get it. I'm so, I'm so embarrassed. I'll just go over there for a little while. Thank you. Come on, Tex. No, 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 no. Tex, te please, can you help me out here? Oh, no, no, no. I'm sure this conversation is a lot more entertaining than whatever you want to say to me. Man, thanks for gathering so quickly. It appears we have a crisis on our hands. I'm now going to turn this meeting over to our chief science engineer, Simmons. Oh, finally, some respect. Who's going to talk for a little while, but not too much. And he's not going to over-explain things in that way he does. And then he's going to stop talking and turn the meeting back over to me. Simmons? Thank you, Sarge. 
Men, I have made a grave discovery. Analyzing the equipment that Lopez was using, I have found that the planet is undergoing a total seismic breakdown. There's clear evidence of an unstoppable chain of events which is leading to a full systemic collapse. Now I realize this may cause some of you to panic. Or it may confuse most of you because you don't understand what I said. Can we wrap this up, please? The world is breaking. We're all gonna die. What? Why would you tell us like that? It's like ripping off a band-aid! You know what? Fuck you guys. Stupid people get to live a life of worry and fear. You're all doomed. This is the worst news ever! Man, don't worry. We've got a plan in place to resolve the problem. I can't wait to hear this. Now we all know that the planet is trying to kill us. So we need to strike back. And quickly! Scare the crap out of it. What? Griff, what's that bad sci-fi movie where they discover a natural disaster and their first attempt to solve the problem is to use a huge bomb? That's every bad sci-fi movie, sir. Exactly. So that's what we're gonna do. Now here's the plan. We're going to build an enormous drilling machine and institute my three-phase plan. Step one, bust through the crust. Step two, skedaddle through the mantle. Step three, bore to the core. Once in the core, we'll set off an enormous bomb to stabilize the planet. How will a bomb stabilize the planet? It won't, duh. But through a series of dramatic setbacks, calamities, and yes, hopefully a few of us dying on the mission, we will find the true cause and solution to the problem. And save the world. Seriously? I like the plan. Me too. Let's do it. Great. I'll get to work on the drill. Donut, you find the deepest, darkest hole where we can stick it in. I have a list of candidates right here. Griff, I need you to build us a bomb. How the hell do I do that? Find a way, son. Time is short. Okay, uh, I guess I'll look on the internet? Excellent. Let's get to work, men. We've got a planet to fight. Let me save. Whatever. Team B report. Team B. Team B is down. We have wounded and are taking fire. We'll be right there. Take it. Get the package. Head it out of the city. Roger that. Tracker. Okay, there he is. I got him. We'll cut him off at the overpass. Go, go! Right there. Come in, mother of invention. We read you, Agent Texas. Go ahead. Phyllis, I need you to fire Ordnance Pod 0401 to my position. I am sorry, but I cannot verify the contents of that pod. Protocol dictates Just that all... Just fire it, Phyllis. Acknowledged. Safety protocol override. Firing pod 0401. Hello there. You didn't fucking hear that? No, man, no. You, it was like... How about that? Did you hear that? Yeah, yeah, I heard it. Surfer, be sure to subscribe to our channel before you go. It'll be just like we're friends. Not that I need friends. <laughs> uh, please don't go. God damn it. <sighs> Still won't start, huh? No, but it's getting there. Did you, uh, try checking the starter? What a brilliant idea. Next you're gonna ask me if I tried the keys. You have keys? No. How do you know so much about vehicles? You know, during the training. We had to learn to care for our equipment. Plus, I've always liked cars. Uh, training, huh? Was that before... Before what? Before I was killed? Before you brought me back as whatever I am now? Oh. You know about that? Well, of course I do. I know what you know. You made me. Well, no, not me. Yeah, whatever. Him. Hey, why did he do it? I don't even remember when you first came around. You were just kind of there one day. It was like a training session or something like that. <sighs> yeah, Wyoming and Maine. Big dummies. But why did he bring you back? You know what, Church? I don't know. You tell me. He didn't exactly ask me what I wanted. I just kind of came along for the ride. I didn't get a vote. But you were there when Alpha was there. Nobody else was. I don't know. What can I say? I guess we were inseparable. There you go. Tank's fixed. See what happens when you treat something right? Yeah. Yeah, as a matter of fact, I think I do. Nice work, Maine. Search. Yeah, subtle as always. Response team is probably on the way. Let's get the hell out of here. Hold on. 
Coming through. Excuse me. Look out. Carolina.
that guy still yelling? Yes. He's been yelling all morning. <sighs> we know. Make him stop. Uh, and how am I going to do that? Shoot him with your snipe. Ah, uh, never mind. I realized how stupid that sounded as soon as I started to say it. Hey, Blues, you still suck. Yeah, you. You fucking piece of shit. You suck. Griff, what the hell are you doing up here? I'm doing my job, Simmons. I'm working on my part of the plan. I thought your part of the plan was to build a bomb. Uh, yeah, but I don't know how to build a bomb. Yeah, I know that. You don't know how to do anything. So, I'm yelling at the Blues. You guys still suck! Until I make them mad enough to bomb our base. Idiots! So, not only will they make me a bomb, I'll get them to deliver it. For free! You guys are lame! I hate you! That is actually the most sensible part of this plan I've heard so far. Your years of laziness have finally paid off in full, Private Griff. Thank you very much, Private Simmons. Now, if you'll excuse me, somebody needs to be called a cunt. As you were, soldier. Hey, you! Yeah, you! You dumb cunts! You suck! Hey, up there! What are you talking about? Huh, Blue? Are you talking about how bad you suck? Because that's what I'm doing! I'm talking about it right here! Only louder! Way louder! Because I'm yelling, Blue Team sucks! Hey, Blue Team! Why are you so sad? Is it because you suck so bad? I think it might be! That's it! I'm taking those fuckers out! Caboose, get my toolkit! Woohoo! Success! What the hell is that? That is my bomb. You guys had an unused robot kit, so I used the parts from it to make this bad boy. Oh, robot kit, right. We don't need that now because I never died. That makes sense. Right. That was Andrew Smith's job. Stop it. This thing doesn't look like a bomb. It looks like a basketball. Oh, yeah? Well, you don't look much like a soldier, dickhead. Looks like a basketball? Sounds like a fucking asshole. Great. I had to include the voice synthesizer because it had the power unit. So now it can talk. In other words, you want me to blow stuff up, you're gonna have to blow me first. Well, he's pleasant. What do you expect? He's a bomb. You want him to be polite, or you want him to kill stuff? I want him to shut up. Anybody care what I want? How about Tucker's mother polishing me 24? Fuck this, I'm out. Out? Just like I got out of your sister. Hey, fuck you, bowling ball. Okay, let's plant this bad boy. Yeah, let's go! Hey, uh, don't forget to lift with your legs, Tex. Yeah, I know how to lift jackass. I've been carrying this team the entire time I've been here. I know I said I was leaving, but that was actually a really good burn. Zing! And today is the day that will carry us to victory against the planet. You can't fight a planet. Now, I know there's been naysayers along the way, but thankfully we haven't listened to Simmons. We stuck to the plan. Donut, do we have our drilling spot? Ready for action, sir. Excellent! Griff, is the bomb ready? Uh, should be here... Any minute? Perfect. And here's our drilling machine that will take us to the center of the Earth like planet. Wow! It's huge! You built that? You know it. Sarge, even I have to admit that that's pretty amazing. You know what's even more amazing? None of us saw it until he pointed it out to us. Thanks. It took a lot of work and planning. I almost didn't get it done. Where did you even get the materials to build this? I mined them using my excavator. That one. What? How did you build that? I didn't. I ordered it online. Red Army catalog. But why don't we just... You know what? Never mind. Once again, I have to say, none of us saw that until he pointed it out. All right, man. It's time to put up or shut up. Let's do this. Griff, we're going to need that bomb. Uh, yeah. I, uh, just, uh, give me a minute. Griff, don't tell me that you didn't... <laughs> Hi there. Oh, right. There we go. One bomb is requested. You're welcome. Ha <laughs> ha, great! I take back all the things I ever said about you, Griff. My pleasure, sir. Tick, 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 tick. Uh, tick. why is this bomb ticking? Tick. Oh, right. Tick. I didn't think that part of the plan through all the tick. way, I guess. Tick. Uh, tick. we're all gonna die now. Griff, tick. I take back the take it back. Don't let it touch anything. I am confused. Do not be concerned. That is completely natural given your state. My state? Was I injured? No. Do you feel as though you have been injured? Counselor, please. Do not be concerned. You're fine. You're safe. Once again, do you know your name? Yes. I know my name. My name is Alpha. No. Your name is not Alpha. You are mistaken. I am sorry. I am confused. Do not be concerned. This is perfectly normal given your state. Would you like to know your name? Yes, please. I would like to know my name. 
I feel very confused. Your name is Delta. That is your name. Delta? Yes. You are very wise, Delta. It is very nice to meet you. I think I remember you. No, you have never met us before. You did not exist before today. Today is your birthday. Today is a great day. Do you know your name? My name is Delta. That is correct. Delta, this is the director. He is going to take good care of you. I am glad to hear that. I am very confused. Don't worry, Delta. That will not last long. And when you feel better, we are going to do incredible things together, you and I. Incredible things. channel, I've taken the liberty of reorganizing everything for a streamlined viewing experience. Just hit subscribe to put it to use. You're supposed to convince them to subscribe, not put them to sleep, you loser. <sighs> I hate him so much. This changed again. Yep. Lots of things changing these days. I think we got more change on the way. You feel it too? You know, I felt it since Texas showed up. And when cops and military started shooting at us, yeah. I find I just keep coming back to the same question in my head. Over and over again. And what question is that? We're the good guys. Right? Yeah, of course we are. Yeah, you don't sound so sure of yourself. No. No, I suppose I don't. I'm trying. I understand. I, I just need more time to... I have to go. 
What are you looking at? Mind your own business. I should say the same. Punch it, Tucker! I am punching it! Well, punch it harder! Not try KKA! Caboose, this is as punch as this thing gets! It's a tank, not a fucking Lamborghini! Good luck, guys. So, think they'll make it? Oh, I think they might have time to squeeze in one last adventure. Can't really ask for more than that, can you? I suppose not. So you decided to stay? Yeah. Finally gave in and believed me, huh? Uh, not exactly. I just figured you haven't steered me wrong so far. <laughs> Why bet against a streak? Well, come sit with me then. I got some great seats for the end of the world. I saved you one. Okay. You sure you want to do this? Yeah. You know, it took a couple versions of me to understand it, but I think sometimes, sometimes you just gotta let go. And if you do, the things you let go sometimes come back on their own. They did today. <laughs> wow. Guess the theory was proven right then. Nick of time. Yeah, I guess it was. So, uh, any regrets? Yeah, a few. I mean, probably should have learned how to shoot this damn sniper rifle. <laughs> You guys did have a lot of downtime. Could have practiced, I don't know, once or twice. Well, what can I tell you? I had other things in my mind, I guess. Hello, everyone. Now that we have our own YouTube channel, I've taken the liberty of reorganizing everything for a streamlined viewing experience. Just hit subscribe to put it to use. You're supposed to convince them to subscribe, not put them to sleep. You loser. <sighs> I hate him so much. Circuit, circuits. Yeah, 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 ye
Sarge? What are you doing up there? What? Is that me? And more importantly, why am I talking with the blue? Attention enormous version of myself! I order you to attack! No. No! The memory unit isn't dying! This isn't the end of the world! It's a fucking rescue mission! No! Well, get him out of there! No! No, stop! Stop it! Leave me here! Our next phase is ready to begin, Carolina. We will be asking you to do a great many things. I'm ready, sir. Some of these things might be... questionable. I'll do whatever it takes. You've given me everything. I would do anything for you. No, no, damn it! Why? Why did you do it? Church, you're alive! Yeah, I knew it! Yeah, I told them! Yeah, she was right! Yeah, we could get you out! All right, then. We're square, Blue. We hope you get your shiny blue buddy out, so that makes us- What are you doing here? Uh, saving you? Yeah, we found you in the place where they were keeping you, and we traveled a really, really long way to come to this place, and fought a bunch of people, and then fought a bunch of more people, and then we got you and took you and saved you in the end. But why would you do that? Why? Well, clearly it wasn't to hear. Thank you. Hey, we're taking fire out here. Thank you? You fucked everything up? I was at peace. I had it figured out. It was over. Put me back. Put you back? Buddy, we just fought through an entire military base to reach you. And now you want to go back? Yes! She said we need you. She was the one who knew how to get you out. She? Who, who are you talking about? Tex? The real Tex? Tex? No, no, not Tex. The new lady. New lady? Hey there, Alpha. Been looking for you for a long time. Oh, no. Now that I've found you, you're gonna help me do what I should have done years ago. You're gonna help me kill the director.
And now, the moment you've all been waiting for, from the far distant system of Sang Helios, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly, the bad boys of Griffball Team. I hate to intrude, but you have not performed any work in the past 13 minutes and 42 seconds. That strikes me as rather inefficient. Oh, uh, sorry, I was just trying to, uh, you know, how do you, how do you get a new window? You know, like the, you know, like a new window. What's a button thing for that? I believe you know? the keys you are looking for are Alt-Tab. Oh, yeah, thanks little guy. Wait, who are you? You don't look like the normal hollow projection. That is because I am the AI designated as Delta from Project Freelancer. Wait, you're Project Freelancer? I mean, aren't those the bad guys? There is no need for name calling. I submit that Project Freelancer is neither good nor bad, much like your own forces. We are merely two groups dedicated to obtaining different results. Whoa, man. That's, that's deep. It's like, it's like there's different universes, but you know, there's... <laughs> Don't encourage him. He's already long-winded as it is. <laughs> Thank God. I thought you two would never stop chit-chatting. I'm not sure that was entirely necessary. He seemed open to the logic I presented him. Perhaps he would have allowed us to carry out our mission. I'm sorry I knocked out your new friend. Now you two will never get to have a beer together. I believe that would have been unlikely, regardless. Showtime. Come in, Agent York. Are you in? Yes, sir. These guys love their holographic locks. I'll let Delta take a peek in their system while I try to disable it manually. You're up, D. Curious. What's curious? That's code for bad, isn't it? I've detected an anomaly inside of the system. Something that is not supposed to be there. Diverting subroutines to investigate. Don't get too curious in there. I need your attention on this lock. Do not worry, Agent York. I have already rectified several instances where you would have tripped the alarm system. Oh, oh, head. What, wait, what? Wait, wait, give me back my leprechaun. <laughs> What was that, Delta? Nothing, sir. Agent, may I remind you that we are running short on time. Warning, an alarm has been remotely triggered. What? By who? They knew we were coming. Agent York, abort intrusion immediately. We are moving to more direct measures. Wait, wait, wait. I can do this. I can do this. Just give me a moment, System sir. System online, Director. I agree with the Director. I have yet to see you successfully open a lock in the field, and this alarm will only hamper your progress. Okay, now don't you start in on me, too. We've been talking to Wash again, have you? Agent York, we are out of time. I repeat, abort. Target locked. Um, what target is locked? What's the target? Delta, what are they doing? Taking more direct measures. You knew about this? Possibly. Why you Project Freelancer, and you're my best bet for figuring out what hole he's hiding in. Hole, hey! You know where Buddy Donut was always talking about his holes? Sarge. Constantly trying to get people to look at them and whatnot. Come on, Sarge. He's dead now. He was shot. Remember? Oh, right. Probably has a few more holes then, huh? <laughs> what, too soon? What's the appropriate amount of time that can go by for that joke to be okay? Uh, whatever, you big blue baby. Shut up, Sarge. What are you doing alive, Carolina? You're supposed to be dead. This is impossible. That's a funny thing to say. For a guy who's literally a ghost. Uh, yeah, actually, he's not a ghost. Um, he's a computer program. He gets holographically projected on our armor when he wants to talk to us. Seismographic computer programs? <laughs> Caboose, you say the craziest things sometimes. What an imagination on you. Yeah, I don't know what that first word means, but it sounds the same. I will allow it. Hey, how are we doing in here? Wash? You got Epsilon out? Good. We can't hold them off much longer. They're not too happy about us breaking in. Let me see what I can do to help that. <laughs> Same old Carolina. I guess coming back from the dead doesn't change anybody. Washington? Why are you wearing blue armor? Why are you wearing my armor? Oh. Um. Oh, yeah. Yeah. They sort of used me to... 
replace you on blue team? Replace me? I wouldn't really use the word replace, but there's no word for take over for you and make everything better almost immediately, so we just say replace. When did this happen? Oh, do you remember when you went into the memory unit and then everyone was sad? Yeah? It was right after that. Right after I left? Well, it was right after, you know, but, you know, it was like five or... 10 seconds. You've got to be kidding me. Life is short, Epsilon. We had to move on. I think I just got dumped by Caboose. This is unfucking believable Yeah, it's... it's not me. It's you. Epsilon, they just needed to even the teams. It's really not... Hey, would you guys stop calling me Epsilon? I'm Church now. Oh, uh... We sort of call the new guy Church. You know? Sometimes. What? Uh, Caboose just finds it easier. The armor color confuses him. As do a lot of things. Let me get this straight, Agent Washington. You took my name, too? It's only in certain circumstances. Like when we talk to him, or need to fill out paperwork, or saying happy birthday to him. You gotta be fucking kidding me! Well, this is awkward. You know, I think the quickest solution would be a good old-fashioned thinning of the ranks with my trusty shotgun. Any takers? We're fine. Well, it's worth a shot. You win this round, Blue. But I'll be back. Actually, this guy's been kicking our ass. I'm kind of glad to have you back. Sure will be nice to have an idiot in Georgia Blue Team again. Thanks. It's great to be needed. Everyone front and center now! Greetings, fellow web surfer. Be sure to subscribe to our channel before you go. It'll be just like we're friends. Not that I need friends. <laughs> Please don't go. Sir, enemy fighters approaching. Fight will, Counselor. Let's send them back to the scrapyard. It appears we are now taking fire. Release the dropships. Get the team in position. quicker than we thought, out of the frying pan, into the shit. We're going to need a new insertion point. York was supposed to open the leader's hangar for us. It wasn't my fault! We'll have to settle for the main hangar. Which one is that? The one with the shooty things coming out at us. Never a dull moment, huh? I'd get your team ready. We're gonna come in hot. You heard her. We're going for the main hangar. Be ready for anything. So much for a smooth ride. <laughs> What's the matter? Feeling sick? Hey, I'm not the one that needed a barf bag on all our family trips. How are you feeling? Are you up to this? Say what you want to say, Wash. It's just, getting up your AI was a big deal. I thought maybe- I'll be fine. Worry about yourself. You're awfully quiet. Oh, just trying to prepare myself. Hey, worst comes to worst, we'll just get kicked off the leaderboard. At least us ladies will be sticking together, right? Damn it! <sighs> Opening rear bay! Right! All together! Use your pack sparingly! Course correction only! You don't want to end up like Georgia! Wait, what happened to Georgia? Nobody knows! I never found him! Are you sure these things are safe? Now! Rolling out the red carpet? No ass face. Look. Oh hell. Oh! Not again. Sorry about that. Ow! Of 
security override. Come on. Damn it! Uh-oh. That's not good. Uh, hey guys! This might be a little floaty. Uh, what the fuck? Everyone, enable grab boost! Why do cars hate me? They know we're inside. Wash, north, secure that hallway. South, see if you can access the leader's location. We don't leave without him. Got it! I'm already on it! CT, get me... Where the hell is CT? by the enemy. I'm surprised there's anything left in the databanks. <laughs> Not everyone follows protocol. You should know that better than anyone. You really think they found another artifact? How could nobody have discovered that when they were processing the wreckage? They didn't know where to look. And they didn't have what you have. Sir, we are in position, awaiting your signal. on an extraction plan. They should be here right about... Now. So. Damn you, Private Griff! You took out those two soldiers before I could administer my lethal brand of red justice! Now where are Simmons? I don't know. We found another warthog and he was right behind me. Entrance, dude. Very thrilling. Hey, I don't need all that flash. Some of us have respect for the fundamentals. Hey, what did I tell you before? You know you're not allowed to use words that have the term fun in them. I'm riding with you next time. He actually stopped at the train tracks. That's the law! We were under fire! Still the law. Simmons, only you can manage to make a high speed chase boring. Thank you, sir. What is that song? Uh, it's a Bolivian orchestral mashup. Obviously, you haven't heard of them yet. Thank God for that. I still don't understand. Why did you guys rescue me? Don't blame us. Blame Mrs. Fussy Bridges. Yeah, um, actually, it's Miss Fussy Bridges. She gets really mad when you say it wrong. She wanted to get you out of that memory, wasn't it? Something about you being the genetic fine and mental imprint to McCall and of that Professor Watch's puss. Can somebody translate that? I don't speak Huckleberry. Yeah, the mean lady wants to find the director, and since you have all his memories, you might know where he went. Wow, that actually seemed too correct for you, Caboose. There must have been some part of that that you didn't understand. And when she finds it, we're going to throw him a very big surprise party. Ah, uh, there we go. Sure. As long as surprise party means shooting him in the face and then walking away in slow motion. <laughs> surprise! <laughs> 
Well, I, you know, I hate to break it to you, but I don't know how much help I'm going to be. I mean, I may have the director's memories, but that doesn't mean I remember them. Yeah, I have the same problem. I barely remember any of my own memories. And none of anyone else does. Well, you better start remembering, Blue. I had to watch Griff nearly die three times today. It's like fate was laughing at me. Why don't you just take him already? I gotta say, I'm pretty surprised to see you taking orders from a Blue, Sarge. Uh, under duress. What, you didn't want to come? Let's just say you seem to know a lot of women with quick tempers. You got a fetish or something? I guess you could say, yeah, apparently. Want to talk about it? No. Want to talk about it with No. Me? Okay, everyone load up. Nav points are in your HUDs. Alternate navs uploaded to your secondary objectives. Sync? Sync? Oh, uh, right. Everyone, just say sync. Whenever she says that. Oh. Sink? Refrigerator. You guys not used to getting orders? Oh, we're used to getting them, all right. We just aren't used to doing much with them. We're retreating. Oh, okay, yeah. That's usually step one in most of our plans. Sink? Easy bake of it. Let's just go. What do you mean the leader's not here? Exactly what I said. His last check-in is upstairs in the main deck, but his call sign just appeared in their internal frequencies. He's broadcasting from Mountain Bone Valley. Meaning he's not here. Gee, you're starting to sound like a broken record. Fine. Change of plans, everyone. We're heading into the junkyard. This is beginning to feel more and more like a setup. not believe the time I had getting back. It's nuts out there. Let's go, people. What? No welcome back? All right. Welcome back. Where are they off to in such a hurry? I found the leader. He's hiding out in Bone Valley. We're going all the way over there? After what happened to Georgia? Would someone please tell me what happened to Georgia? Dude, you do not want to know. I really do, though. Time to get out of here. You too. I can't. Not yet. If they weren't onto you before, they definitely will be now. Come with us, Connie. I'm not gonna lose you over this. All forces, we are go. I repeat, we are go. church. Wait, did you just now realize that church isn't here? He's not going to be pleased about this one. Calm down, moron. We didn't leave him behind. Uh, yes, but you see, I am not seeing him, so... Where is he? Ugh. You don't want to know. Church! You're... You're so small. I would like to feed you a small cracker. How you like the new place, Tinkerbell? You mean your disgusting storage unit? What? How is my storage unit disgusting? Well, for starters, I had to delete 50 gigs worth of crap just so I could fit in this thing. Whoa, 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 hang on a second, dude. You didn't delete my, uh, home movies folder, did you? And that brings me to my second point. What a bunch of worthless idiots. Yeah, they're idiots, but they're not that bad once you get to know them. Hmm. You know, we almost managed to trap the meta the last time we were here. But you didn't. 
No. I guess not. I don't get it. Everything stopped. Maybe they're retreating. Nothing left out here but a bunch of junk. This is 479er. I've lost visual on targets. It's like they all just left. Sir, their outpost is disabled, and it looks as if we have driven off the remaining fighters. Well, good riddance to bad rubbish, Counselor. Indeed, sir. All enemy systems appear to be offline. Wait. What is it?
They're looking at me. That's because they want to meet you. This is York and Wash. Hey there, little... computer... dude. Give it a rest, Wash. Theta, I have a friend just like you. His name is Delta. Really? Yeah. Here, you, you want to say hello to him? Um... York? It's okay, man. Just for a second. Hello, Theta. I am Delta. It is nice to meet you. Hello. See? Everybody here is nice. Isn't that right, Delta? Agent North, I do not feel qualified to make a judgment about humans with whom I have only limited experience. Also, nice is a rather subjective term Delta. for... Delta! Oh, yes. Everyone here is... nice. Within standard acceptable deviations. Delta! And that's my sister over there, South. We're twins. I have a sister. You do? We have many siblings. What do you mean by... Hello, everyone. I hope you're ready to begin our test. Delta, I believe you know the protocol about communicating directly with other AI units. I apologize, sir. I will log off. Don't. I want you to help administer the test. Gentlemen, if you will take the floor. Okay, just like we practiced. Are they all going to watch? Of course. They want to see if you're as good as I said you are. Really? Well, I guess that's okay. That's the spirit. Come on, let's do this. Delta, I expect you to follow protocol at all times. We were only attempting to make the new unit more comfortable. It's my fault, sir. I asked him to. The new kid seems kind of shy. Agent North was paired with Theta for a reason. His nurturing nature is best suited to care for Theta's unique personality. Yeah, he is used to looking out for people, isn't he? Quite. Delta, your skills are more analytical in nature. If I may disagree. Theta has made double the number of declarative statements since my appearance. That indicates a 100% increase in confidence since we modified our interaction strategy. I think that speaks volumes to my caring algorithms. You make an excellent point, Delta. Let's begin the test. Begin the test. As you may recall, Agent North used his equipment in the field on a previous mission. He was able to successfully maintain a deflective shield for 3.4 seconds in order to block an explosive projectile attack. And somehow managed not to kill himself in the process. The maneuver only had a 0.1% chance of success, and he performed it 999 more times. I'm rather certain he would have been obliterated on each one. Hey, I'd rather be lucky than good any day. You usually are. Luck will only take one so far. I am in the business of getting results. Let's see what Theta can do. Delta, reduce shield strength by 50%. Modifying. Power dropping! Theta! Remaining power to compensate for critical tiles. Okay. Add variables. Acknowledged. Great job, Theta. Stop talking to me. You must be up. Right. Sorry. Reset. Your objective now is to eliminate all turrets. Begin. I thought the shield works both ways. There's no way for him to attack. Theta, analyze turret rate of fire. Adjust shield to match. Okay. Sorry. Firing. On my mark. Ready. Mark! All targets eliminated. Test complete. Excellent. Wow! Wow! That was incredible! <laughs> yeah, what did I tell you? And we're sure they don't get any bigger. <laughs> Dude, you are killing me with that! Sarge, how come every time the Blues get involved in something stupid and dangerous, we get dragged along too? You know what they say. Keep your friends close, and your enemies within range of your primary firearm! Sir, I realize- So you can shoot them! I realize that we agreed to help Wash and Carolina, but how do we know that they're going to help us? What do you mean? I mean, if we run into trouble, do you really think they'll stick their neck out for us? Well, for a backstabbing, double-crossing, no-good, dirty, rotten blue, that Wash fella isn't too bad. What a ringing endorsement. I'm more worried about Carolina. 
What if after all this is over, she decides to get rid of us? Why would she do that? I don't know. To tie up loose ends? To cover her trail? Don't you watch spy movies? They love that shit! My god, man! Get a hold of yourself! You're making us look weak in front of the enemy! Hello. Listen, I don't want to hear talk about secret double crosses or mysterious subplots or freelancer conspiracies anymore! We've had enough of those going on around here as it is! But don't you think that- Sorry, sorry. I can't really talk right now, Simmons. I've got to go secure a perimeter over at the, uh, shady spot over there. I liked it better when we only had to fight you. Yeah. This team is pretty awesome right now. Right, Tucker? Right, Church? Hello. Uh, where's the rest of your team? Looking for something? Leads. Information. Anything. You said Maine had been through here, right? Well, yeah, but that was ages ago. Then look closely. Don't tell me hanging around these morons has turned you soft. Hey, she said morons! That's us! Tucker, shut up! Let me listen! The Meta was attempting to transfer energy from these turbines into his suit. It was the only way he could keep his equipment running. Poor Maine. Carolina, it wasn't your fault. But it was my AI. None of us could have known what would happen. Yeah? Well, sometimes I'm not so sure. What? We were told that the AI were specifically designed for each of us. North was chosen for Theta. York had Delta. But Sigma was mine. What are you saying? You really think the director didn't know what would happen? Carolina, that's ridiculous. He always had his little experiments. He just forgot to take a few extra variables into account. And what about now? The whole world thinks you're dead. Do you think he knows you're coming for him? Yes, I do. And for once, I look forward to proving him right. <sighs> the director was always hard on you. Dude, he said hard on. <laughs> Patrick, shut up. They're gonna hear you. He was hard on all of us. Oh, come on. You gotta let me have that one. Quiet, you're gonna give away our position. I've got about five positions in mind for her. Now, Chicka Tucker, I'm serious. Yeah, you're right. But you have to admit, he was also pretty hard on himself. That's it, I'm doing it. Tucker! Now, Chicka <laughs> Whoa! Same team! Same team! What are you doing here? Okay, take it easy, Carolina. We just wanted information. Epsilon? Look, if you two are planning on dragging us around wherever you want, the least you can do is fill us in. I'll fill her in. Now, Chicka Tucker! Sorry. You and your squad are on a need-to-know basis. And right now, you don't need to know anything. What? Seriously? Jesus. You're worse than text. Dang. Okay, that one was on you. Get out! Fine. We're leaving already. Hey, Tucker, I need you to leave. I can't actually do it on my own. Carolina, you've got to calm down. Don't tell me how to lead my squad, Washington. Now, sweep the area and report back to me when you're done. <sighs> On it, boss. And as the director accurately predicted in his thesis on the subject, we see that cognitive impression modeling can be segregated from the host. Naturally, this remains an inherently deconstructive process. But most of all, the biggest concern of any full AI entity is the prospect of rampancy, which we covered last week. Of course, our AI units are what we call fragments. So there's very little chance that a personality subroutine can run off unchecked. Are there any questions? Yeah, I got a question. Why do we need to learn all this stuff? AI theory is like vehicle maintenance, South. If we're going to use this equipment, any equipment, we need to know how to care for it. Oh yeah, like a coffee maker or a vacuum cleaner. That was rather rude. Oh, cry me a river, light bulb. No, not the same as that. Well, I don't even have one because someone didn't bring enough to share, so why am I sitting through this elementary classroom bullshit? I don't have one either, South. That's only because you gave yours to Maine. He needed to be able to communicate after his injury. Oh, yeah, that's the only reason you did it. You're a real hero, Carolina. 
It's not like Maine has much to say anyway. I would like to say just how appreciative the two of us are for Carolina's sacrifice. Agent Carolina, if anyone can excel without an AI unit, it is you. Thank you, Sigma. And Agent Texas, of course. That goes without saying. Right. I notice she doesn't have to attend class. Agent Texas doesn't need this training. What the director is trying to say is that Agent Texas has already completed her AI theory coursework. I think that's enough for today. If I may, Counselor, I have just one last question. Oh, come on. On the different levels of AI awareness and rampancy. Melancholia, anger. Specifically the fourth stage of rampancy. Metastability. Yes. Yes. The meta stage, in which an AI can be considered fully human. That is only theoretical, Sigma. No AI has ever achieved such a state. But it is possible. In theory, but... But possible. But possible. I find that very interesting. Remember, Sigma, you are not even a full AI. You are what we call a fragment. So something of that magnitude would be even more difficult for an entity such as yourself. Well, as the director always says, it is important to have ambition. Why, yes it is. Class is dismissed. Sigma, are you coming? Yes. 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 I will be joining you shortly. Um, hey, hi, hi, Karen. Uh, yes, uh, excuse me. Um, have you seen Church lately? Uh, yeah, he and I were supposed to hang out after we rescued him. Tell your friends to stay out of my way, or else. Or else what? Or else they'll bring out my ugly side. Oh, come, oh, come on, Karen. I, I bet you're really pretty under that armor. What? I mean, you know, I mean, who has it? I mean, I understand there's some helmet hair. We all have helmet hair time to time, but, you know. Yes, um, so anyways, uh, what did you want me to tell Church and Tucker again? Just try and put that into words. Explosion. You know, I I'm beginning to think Simmons might have had the right idea about this Carolina chick. See? I told you! Normally I would agree with Simmons, but in this case that would also cause me to agree with Griff. Therefore, I will simply grunt ambiguously. Hey, did Carolina come this way? We've got to get going soon. Right. We've been meaning to talk to you about that. About what? This whole finding the director thing. You mean the mission? Yeah. That. We were thinking, now that we've helped you find Church, we should probably just let you handle the rest. You know, wouldn't want to cramp your style? That whole freelancer thing? You're good at that. So you're abandoning the mission. Red Team never abandons the mission! We're just accepting an alternate mission of different risk. Less risk. Less is different. Securing the front lines of Red Base. Going home is risky? On what scale? Well, we haven't been there in ages. Who knows what kind of nefarious ne'er-do-wells have moved in on our territory? Hmm. I guess you're right. What? Well, you are wanted criminals of the UNSC. I wouldn't be surprised if they were setting up an ambush for you right now. What? I suppose I can't stop you. Anyway, I'm gonna go find Carolina. Good luck. On second thought, you could probably use the extra help! Yeah, we're sticking with you. Never abandon the mission. Simper the simpering thing. Simper s s s Fuck it. Greetings, fellow web surfer. Be sure to subscribe to our channel before you go. It'll be just like we're friends. Not that I need friends. <laughs> Please don't go. Facility is clear. Find anything? Nothing we didn't already know. Figured as much. This place was a dead end. Sorry, boss. The structure we're going to next. You're positive our target was there. I know what I saw. That's why it's on our list. But I know what I saw. And it doesn't make any sense. All the more reason to investigate. All right, then. Let's go. 
Let's go find CT. To the director of Project Freelancer, Dr. Leonard Church. Dear director, allow me to introduce myself. I am a representative of the newly formed UNSC Oversight Subcommittee. Our organization is charged with the protection of high-level assets of the military, one of which recently went missing. These assets are entrusted to our programs as a privilege, not as a right. As such, they will be safeguarded with the utmost care. In these dark times, mankind has the opportunity not only to prove his humanity, but to earn it. Well, third craft this afternoon. Let's see who else is arriving. I look forward to a long and mutually beneficial relationship for our two departments. Yours truly, Malcolm Hargrove, Assistant to the Oversight Subcommittee Chairperson. It's her. Can't believe he trusts that bitch after what she did to us. There she is. Come in, Command. Tell the Director she's here. What is it? It's nothing. Come on. Congratulations, Director. Another successful test. A new fragment was harvested this morning, Counselor. Find it a match. This morning? That is ahead of schedule. Our time grows short. Find it a match. Director, Wyoming reported in. And? You won't like what he found, sir. Agent Carolina, information never displeases me. It's ignorance that I find unforgivable. Report. It's like you said. CT is with them. You know what to do. I do not need to remind you how valuable our technology is, Carolina. She doesn't have an AI, sir. And she wasn't exactly the best agent. CT will be an acceptable loss. But her armor must not fall into the wrong hands. I understand. Will we be the only forces sent out on this mission, sir? Leave personnel decisions to me, agent. Just do your job. It's time to cut the head off the enemy once and for all. Yes, sir. So how do you even know this Carolina chick? Oh, Tex used to tell me stories. You mean tell Alpha stories? Oh, yeah, I guess. You know, whatever. It's hard for me to know whose memory I'm in. Oh, uh, yeah, same thing happens to me with things I'm in. Like my helmet. That's why I wrote my name on the inside of it. I used my tongue. That was hard to do. Now I can't pronounce my guy. So, how many people are you? I don't know, a bunch, I guess. Are they all assholes? Yeah, a dozen different fragments and we all have the same shitty circle of friends. Lucky us. That's really great, Theta. Thank you. I worked super hard on it. Ugh. Hey, Theta. You mind if I talk to North for a second? Uh, okay. Need you to shut down while we chat, okay? Delta Two. You know, it's the rules. North? It'll be okay. I won't talk too long. All right. What's up? I need to ask you about something. Oh, okay, shoot. I need to ask you about the Alpha. Where did you hear that word? Same place you heard it. Up here. What's an Alpha? Wash, are you eating inside your helmet? Maybe. Delta said they got the helmet waste disposal out of beta. That it would make my eating more efficient. <laughs> and you believe that? Maybe he is getting more personable. It's not an Alpha Wash, it's THE Alpha. Theta thinks about him a lot. More than thinks, really. He's, he's obsessed. Delta Two. You know how all the units call each other brother? They call this one father. No, that's not right. Creator. Yeah. I thought the director would be their creator. Haven't you been paying any attention in class? AIs aren't created. They're copies of someone. But our AIs are just fragments. Which begs the question, where's the original? So this alpha thing is what 
and creates a fragment. Jesus, will you swallow for God's sake? It creates them? Yeah, Theta isn't clear. It creates them or something. Yeah. It's the or something part that has me worried. Hello, everyone. Now that we have our own YouTube channel, I've taken the liberty of reorganizing everything for a streamlined viewing experience. Just hit subscribe to put it to use. You're supposed to convince them to subscribe, not put them to sleep, you loser. <sighs> I hate him so much. Yep, she's right up there. We'll see. Take me there. Sink. Sink. Automatic gauge washer. Man, where was this chick back when we had that awesome tank? Bitches love tanks. I don't get it. What is she looking for? You tell me. I don't know half of what's happening these days. You found me here, remember? Oh yeah. You were actually kind of a badass that time. Dude, I'm kind of a badass all the time. You guys just happened to notice it then. Ah, uh, that's not true. I never noticed it. Look, the point is she's not telling us everything. I just don't understand why. Who knows, man? I've tried everything I can to get some info out of her. I tried hitting on her. I tried sleeping with her. I tried making out with her. Sounds like a complete effort. Dude, no kidding. I used the whole playbook. I even used my best pickup line. Hey, baby, did you fall from heaven? Because I've always wanted to bone an angel. Tucker, be honest. Have you ever had sex with anything besides an alien? Church. The more important question here is, do you know any girls who aren't complete bitches that won't sleep with me? <laughs> Sorry, dude. That seems to be all I have in my life. You're like the worst wingman ever of all time. We parking? Indeed we are. The enemy base is right below us. How far below? Do you really want to know? Probably not. Do I want to know? 75,000 feet. Yeah, uh, that's high. No wonder you guys need computer programs. Yes, that's very high. That is approximately 14.2 miles. Thanks, D. You do not need to do that anymore. Automatic conversion routines offline. What's the plan? Well, we know they're ready for us. I figure that they have defenses pointed in every direction, except... Except they're probably not looking straight up. They're probably not looking straight up. You thinking about a dive bomb? Oh, no. Sort of, but if we did a dive bomb, our engines would register on their thermals, let them know that we're coming. I'm thinking something else. Probably want to tighten that harness. Oh, no. Express elevator going down. I think I'm going to be sick. You know, these suits are supposed to eliminate all waste. You could probably throw up in your helmet and it would take care of it for you. Yeah, you should test that, Wash. You two are assholes. Actually, York, we were never able to get the vomit disposal patch beyond beta. Agent Washington would likely drown. Yikes. Way to kill the mood, D. Hey, York, send that little green guy up here. D, you heard her. Front and center. 
May I be of assistance? Hey, buddy, I need you to tell me when I can fire the jet to the last possible second. You know, to avoid crashing. Please don't say crashing! I understand. To prepare, I will need to calibrate for your reaction time. Fine, go ahead. When I say mark, you say sink. Mark. Sink. Mark. Sink. Calibration complete. So, we're good. I have a high degree of confidence we will be able to complete this maneuver. Wait a second. Why did you just blink like that? That was just a standard maintenance routine. Dude, did you just make a backup of yourself? Confidence is one thing, but it is always prudent to prepare for failure. <sighs> That's a dick move, green guy. I apologize if I have offended. Dick move. Prepare to fire engines on my mark. Five. Four. Three. Agent Maine, isn't that the soldier from the freeway? The one that shot you in the throat? I thought so. Sick him. Where am I? Oh, well, that looks nice. Oh my god! A giant person! Agent Maine, isn't that the soldier from the freeway? The one that shot you in the throat? I thought so. Sick him. Hello, 
out, gentlemen. Hey, Sig. You sure he's good to fight so soon? He was hurt pretty bad. As compared to whom, Agent York? You two don't look so good yourselves. Hello, brother. Sigma. Protocol dictates that AI units are not to communicate directly with each other. Protocol is just another way of saying rules, Delta. Remember what the director says. There are no rules on the battlefield. Besides, we AI should really stick together. Excuse me, I'll be right back. I'll be honest. That one kind of gives me the creeps. Yeah, I hear you. Come on, let's move. Well, hello. What a pleasure to see you again. Pleasure's all mine, bitch. Oh, fuck you guys. You 
you're gonna solve so many crimes! Establish a line on that side. York and Wyoming, you... That's because she didn't. Is that who I think it is? If what you're saying is true, how could this have happened? We need to get to the escape vehicle. I'm not leaving them! You don't understand. They want me! They don't care about the rest of you. I know too much. If I leave, they will follow me. Quiet. That room is guarded by turrets. I can get past them. If there was a way to do it, I would have already done it. York, I need you to cut the power on the main complex. <laughs> a little busy out here. Just do it. Let's see what I can do. Sounds like a good excuse to get out of this firefight. Good show, mate. That's the spirit. Still have a bit of fight in you. So much for that plan. What now? Hey, Carolina, the power's 
hours off. We noticed. What, no thank you? This was a complicated... Actually, I did most of the work, Agent York. Give it a rest, D. CT, you have something that belongs to Project Freelancer. And you know how the director hates to share. You two are fools. The director is playing you, don't you see it? CT, stop it! We know you've been feeding intel to the Resistance for months. <laughs> is that who he told you we are? They're not the enemy, Carolina. We're the ones working outside the rules, not them. You don't know what the director's done. He's broken major laws. When this war ends, we're all gonna have to pay for his crimes. Maybe some of us are already paying for that. You need to stop talking, CT. No. I know what you are, Tex. And I won't take orders from a shadow. What did you just call me? You're coming with us, CT. This is your last chance. No. I'm not going anywhere with you. Actually, we don't need you. We just need your armor. I'm drinking the narrative. People no! say it's suicide of the air. Who's the bomb? Info. It's not complete, but it will get them started. Go. Find the new artifact. Just rest, Connie. Just rest. Connie. 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 No. No. our objective. But why come out here? What's the motivation? I have a feeling this will tell us. Hello! Yes! I'm here to talk to you about subscribing to our channel! It does. Bye! What the heck just happened? So, uh, how do you feel? I feel like running over each and every one of you. So pretty much the same as before. Yeah, pretty much. You know, Simmons, I think I'm gonna let you call shotgun on this one. Fuck that. Man, this sucks. What are you complaining about? You finally got your own body. My own body? Tucker, I'm a fucking Tonka truck. Okay, yeah, but you could literally pick up chicks with this thing. Oh, yeah, because every girl just dreams about settling down with Optimus Prime. Hog! Caboose. Don't do that. 
sorry. All right, places, people. Here they come. Don't forget to shout your prize. Kaboo, shut up. Tucker, bring Epsilon over here. I've got some questions for him. God damn it. Any luck? I think so. All right, data pad accepted. Looks like we're in business. So, uh, what do you need church for? I just told you. Oh, yeah. But, I mean, you could talk to me instead. Sup, girl? Why on earth would I ever want to do that? Well, you know, we're a perfect match. We're both super good-looking badass rebel owners, and we've got the same color armor. Greenish-blue. Uh, aquamarine. Turquoise? Hey, what the fuck color is this anyway? Listen, it's important that we figure out what's on CT's data pad. It might be our next clue to finding the director. Hey, I know that thing. Wait, you recognize this artifact? Hell yeah, it was the biggest pain in the ass. Ah, oh, it's Church. Yeah, he has lost a lot of weight. What? Oh, yeah. Caboose transferred Epsilon from a memory unit into that thing a long time ago. Where is it now? I don't know, who cares? I do. Oh, well in that case, uh, Caboose, tell her where it is. Right, yes. Okay, right, yes. I will do that. Yes. Right. Now. Well, Sarge, you've always wanted to watch a blue die. Looks like you're gonna get your wish after all. Actually, Griff, it's always been my wish to watch you die. Oh, right, yeah. Yep. Every night after you boys would retire to your bunks, I would climb up to the top of the base and just wait, hoping I would see a shooting star so that I could wish for your violent an unbearably painful demise. Okay, you can stop now. I even had a little jingle to go along with it. Please don't. I just wish that Griff was dead. I hate you. Put a bullet through his head. What the sentence? How do you know that song? Oh, it's been in my dreams for years. Now it all makes sense. Oh, thank God. What? I thought I was crazy when I woke up with that rifle in my hands. <laughs> well, ain't that the power of music? Simmons, why didn't you tell me about this? Oh, shut up. It wasn't even loaded. How can you just leave an ancient alien artifact on the floor of a warehouse? Okay, now hold on. I mean, to be fair, you know, we had already broken it. Uh-oh, that's not right. Ugh, I can't believe we came all this way for nothing. You guys are not making my life easy right now. Do we ever? Good point. So, what's the plan now? There's an island nearby that I want to visit. Shouldn't take more than a day or so. That old fortress? Carolina, I'm not sure Watch. there's a... Trust me on this. Right. You should probably listen to your instincts. You stay here and keep the Sim Troopers from causing any trouble. I won't be long. Alright, everyone move into the temple. It'll be getting dark soon. Hey, Wash, where exactly is she going? She lost something. I think she just needs some time to try and find it again. Dear Director, the loss of military equipment is a severe infraction. I should not need to remind you that all UNSC property, especially our more experimental technologies, must be kept from the hands of our enemies at all costs. In these trying times, vigilance is paramount. Still training at this hour. Yeah. She's been like this since we got back from the last mission. You gotta be kidding me. She's always been like this. Well, yeah. I mean, she never did know when to stop, but now it's like she doesn't know how to stop. Always training. I guess the leaderboard beckons. You know, you don't have to watch over her. Could say the same to you about South. That's not really an answer. So what are you doing awake? Theta. Couldn't sleep. And if Theta can't sleep? Ah, one of the side effects they don't tell you about. Having someone else's voice in your head sure does take some getting used to, doesn't it? And Delta's always running these probabilities. Well, that seems annoying. He says it's fun. You know, did you know that statistically, you're as likely to get hit by lightning as you are to die in a pelican crash? It seems like it would be higher considering our line of work. Guess I'm due for a few lightning bolts. <laughs> round complete. A 6.3% increase in efficiency that round, Agent Run Carolina. it again, Phyllis. Resetting training room floor for next round. 
you stay to up late often? You're wondering if he gets scared a lot. Yeah, guess I am. Well, it happens. Mainly at night. He likes when I walk the halls. When we were kids, my dad would have to drive south around in the car to get her to fall asleep. It's kind of the same thing. I wonder if they're all like this. The AI is, you know, jittery, nervous. No, not nervous. Anxious. Yeah, anxious. It's like Delta thinks something bad is always about to happen. I don't get it. What do they have to worry about? Uh, pelican crashes, lightning strikes. Hey, maybe they know something we don't. Why don't you just pull him for a night? Get yourself some sleep. Pull Theta? Yeah. He gets even more scared when I do that. I feel obligated to help. I see why they picked you. Yeah. Well, he has to face his fear at some point. If they want to be human, that's a good place to start. What can I tell you? I guess some things are just harder to face than others. Yeah. Night North. Don't stay up too late. You need your rest. Round complete. Run it again. That last round showed a 3.6% Just increase. run it again. Resetting training room four. Round complete. Run it again. Resetting training room floor for next round. I think we all could use some rest. fellow web surfer, be sure to subscribe to our channel before you go. It'll be just like we're friends. Not that I need friends. <laughs> Please don't go. Okay, I'll take the lead. Give me 15 seconds and follow. Sink? Sink. Fire detected. Cover recommended. Damn it! Jam! Cover! 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 Ah! York, are you okay? How bad is it, Dee? York will not survive. I'm sorry, York. Sorry I didn't listen. I just... I don't understand. Why her? Why Tex? Tex? You. Ah, uh, shit. Let me guess. Just wanted some information. Carolina, I... You don't have a clue. Do you? You and your friends just think I'm some bloodthirsty merc with a bad attitude. But you know what? You're wrong. I'm much worse. Look, you go and round up everyone I know just to bring me back, and then you keep us all in the dark? What the hell did you think was gonna happen, Carolina? Of course no one trusts you. Well, I don't trust them, Epsilon. I don't trust anyone anymore. Oh, why not? Because having friends would ruin the whole psychotic loner bitch thing you've got going on? Because that would be a real shame. It's because I had a team once. A team with the best training, the best equipment, and despite everything that they had that made them the best, they still lied and stole and tore each other to pieces. So you tell me, how the hell am I supposed to trust a ragtag team of idiots when I couldn't even trust the people that were closest to me? That's what I thought. <sighs> I never thought I'd say this, but I can't sleep. Yes, we know. You've been shoveling food into your mouth for an hour. Yeah, what's up with that? It's a nervous habit, okay? No, where the fuck does someone find potato chips in the middle of the desert? Ah, quit your complaining. Carolina is probably miles away by now. The only thing we've got to worry about are sand fleas. And that other highly trained operative on patrol outside. Wow. You have a way with words that just immediately makes me want to kill myself. Look, it's like your little fairy friend said. I thought Donut was your friend. He means church. All we've got to do is stick together, and everything will be just fine. Well, somebody probably should have told Caboose that. Because he's gone. Carolina? I'm done talking to you. Carolina, I think I found something you might want to see. see. Really? What might that be? A memory. Delta? We must be brief. Epsilon is struggling to remember. Remember what? Delta? Delta, please, don't. Good evening, beautiful people. It's a lovely Monday night, and I'm here with another adrenaline-pumping journal entry, courtesy of our good friend Delta. It can't be. 
York, please. Documentation is an important yeah, part yeah. of Yeah. Too many Christmas. Forgive me for trying to lighten the mood. So today, I intercepted some interesting messages from our good friends over at Project Freelancer. It sounds like someone is causing them a bit of trouble. Old news, I know. Old news. But here's the interesting part. D, give me a drum roll, please. I would prefer not to. They said, she. She, as in a lady. Not Wyoming. Not Maine. But a former female freelancer has suddenly popped up on the PFL radar. And if you know me, then you know my money's on the gal in the greenish-blue, seafoam, green, turquoise, whatever it is, armor. Okay? Well, at least, if I had any money. Wait! Still no ID on our female troublemaker. But given what I know about South Last location, fairly certain the odds are in my favor. Again, I must point out that from a statistical standpoint, the odds of Agent Carolina... In other news, Hurricane Delta continues to rain on my parade. So when I finally see her again, I think I've narrowed down my line to like two options, okay? Here, here they are. One, hey there, Carolina. If I said I like your armor, would you hold it against me? Or two... York, please focus. What? Pickup lines are important, man. Did I ever tell you about how we met? See, I was out one night with my buddies. They abandoned me in some ridiculous nightclub. I think it was called Herrera. Herrera. So I'm just sitting there at the bar, bored out of my skull. And I'm flicking this lighter off and on. Then from out of nowhere, she walks up, she just grabs the lighter right out of my hand, and she goes... Agent Foxtrot 12, journal entry 0424, intercepted another transmission from command today. They have confirmed that Agent Texas continues to evade their response teams. That she still does possess the Omega AI. Nothing more to report. York. You know, D, I bet if I had opened up with a pickup line, I would have never seen her again. Why is that? Because she probably would have busted my other eye. What would you have told her, York? I would have told her that I understand why she did what she did. I just wish she hadn't. I wish she could have learned to let things go. I guess I should too. Why did you show me that? Because, because. I know what it's like to spend your life chasing ghosts. Snaking, sneaking, sneaking, sneaking. Hello, Caboose. Hello, Agent Washington. Caboose, you know you're supposed to be in the temple with the rest of your squad. Um, yes, uh, well, um, but see, um, I am spying on you. And why are you spying on me, Caboose? Well, yes, um, since everyone is kind of scared of you and, uh, Carolina, we figured we should try and get as much information on you guys as possible, so, um, where do you guys see yourself for the next five to ten years? Caboose, you realize that when you spy on someone, no one's actually supposed to know that you're spying on them, right? Oh, yeah, I know. I just figured you wouldn't tell anyone. Wait, what makes you think that? Oh, come on, Agent Wall. I mean, I, you know, I'm pretty sure yeah, we can trust you. I mean, we are friends. Friends. I don't understand. These are more than memory. His journal entries were part of the data that Wash recovered, and they stored them in his personnel file. Which just so happened to be one of the many folders that yours truly picked up the last time I visited a freelancer facility. Not bad for a ragtag idiot, if I do say so myself. Feel free to start begging for my forgiveness whenever you feel like it, Carolina. Not happening. What? Seriously? But I will thank you. Yeah, well, I'm pretty great. Church, the director's still out there somewhere, and I need to find him. Not just for what he did to me, but for what he did to York, and to Wash, to Maine, the twins, to all of them. And for what he did to you, Church. I guess I forgot that, in a way, you were there alongside us too. You know, the more memories I sift through, the more that sounds like a pretty damn good plan. Find anything that could help us out? Yeah, it's a lot of stuff to remember all at once, but be able to pull up some of the director's logs if you gave me some time. Well, you'll have plenty of time on our ride back. 
about that. Hey, is there any way we can get back to the others that doesn't involve me carrying you? <laughs> wow, Church. I didn't know an AI unit could get so easily embarrassed. Tell you what. Just tell your friends that you picked me up. How does that sound? Remind me never to let you talk to Tucker again. All right. Pack it up, people. We're moving. Where to now? There's an old ship that crashed in a Freelancer outpost a few years back. Outpost 17B? You mean we're going back to Valhalla? Back to our own base? That's right, assholes. You're finally going home. And you're taking us with you. Hello, everyone. Now that we have our own YouTube channel, I've taken the liberty of reorganizing everything for a streamlined viewing experience. Just hit subscribe to put it to use. You're supposed to convince them to subscribe, not put them to sleep. You loser. <sighs> I hate him so much. Where am I? Oh, well, that looks nice. Oh my god! A giant person! Bullshit! South, calm down. Calm down? That's easy for you to say. You already have an AI. Who the fuck is she to take away our place? Uh, our turn will come? They've already put me back on the list for... What? Ugh! You ever notice every time you open your mouth you make things worse? Sorry. And two AI? Why is she so special? What's so special about either of them? Ugh! Pick it up. What are you doing in here? You never come in here. I've come for Carolina. Pick it up. I, I should probably, uh, I better go. Where is she? Look, Texas, I don't know if you're looking for a fight or whatever it is you want, but now's really not the time. Carolina just went into surgery. We don't know when she'll be out, so we're heading over to Recovery to wait for her. Yeah, Recovery 1. Maybe you should come with us. Let's go. You coming, Texas? Yeah. Go on, York. I'm right behind you. new base? Looks the same as a shitty old base to me. Oh, you're gonna dump it here! You know, it's like our home away from home that we can't ever get away from. So let me get this straight. It's just two bases in the middle of a box canyon. Yes, but on one side, instead of a wall, there's an endless supply of water. Wow. You guys really know how to upgrade. Let me guess. I bet this time we've got a tank with eight pedals instead of six. Ah, oh, don't be silly. We don't have a tank. All right, what have you got? Not much. A few shell casings, a dog tag... I was talking to church. Oh, sorry, I... Hey, what's up? Somebody call me? Yeah. Find anything yet? Oh, not yet, but the uh, onboard computer program's an old friend of mine. She's doing her best to help me out. Good. Keep it up. Wash, is there a reason you're just standing there doing nothing? Get back to it. Um, right. Yes, sir, boss. Can't keep your secrets forever, Texas. Not from me. Never from me. Should be coming around any moment. What's he in for? 
Probably for all the headaches he's been having. Did you ever get them after you earned Delta? At first, they went away pretty quick, though. The other side effects were way worse. What other side effects? You know, bleeding from the eyes, ringing ears, inverted penis. Inverted what? <laughs> Dude, I'm just fucking with you, okay? Couple of headaches, that's it. So what's different about Maine, then? Hey, she's awake. How you feeling, champ? I want a match. Right. Now. What's up, Forever Alone? So, uh, you want to do something with your life, or you just want to sit around on your ass all day like a loser? Yeah, me too. So, uh, just subscribe and keep watching YouTube. It's way easier. how to use already. Or just grab everything and anything. That works too, I guess. Hey, I've got this one, Omega. Uh, next time. Agent Jordan, please clear the floor. In a second, Phyllis. Now, at first the voice of the AI, sorry, AIs, it will feel like a tickle. Okay, just focus on that, and it will get clear. Trust them. I know that'll be hard, but I promise they'll help. Agent George, clear the floor, please. In a second, Phyllis. Clear the floor or enter the match. Your choice. For the record, I would stay to support you, but she's really damn scary. Okay, maybe you're both pretty scary. Gotta go. Anyone want to bet that one of them gets killed? Are you kidding? I'm hoping one of us doesn't get killed just by watching. Round begins in three, two, one. Begin. Good luck, lady. Thanks. Thanks. I won't need it. What the hell is going on here? No matches have been authorized for. No, Allison. Director, we should sedate Carolina. Immediately. We have no idea how much damage 2AI could- No. She made her decision. Let her be. Come on! Somebody help her! Ah! What the fuck is going on? Somebody get down here! You are all dismissed. Kid, this is for your own good. Nothing. Nothing. A dead end. Damn it, not again. Hey, watch it! I'm still in here. Response teams beat us to the crash, plain and simple. We knew the chances of finding something here were slim. Okay, well, what about the bases? Blue base was swept clean. As for red base, any evidence that might have been there was completely destroyed during the construction of some kind of giant holographic projection room. Man, those guys are really starting to find creative ways to ruin my life. Motherfuckers. This is our third wild goose chase, Wash. Even after she's gone, Texas is still finding ways to screw me over. You can't blame her for this. Time isn't on our side, Carolina. Any trails he left behind likely went cold years ago. Are you suggesting we give up? Of course not. I was just- Good. Then go spread the word. We're leaving. But... we just got here. What's your point? 
Well, don't you think we're pushing these guys a little too hard? This place is pretty much home to them. They may not be ready to leave it so soon. Yeah, I'm real choked up about it. Despite what those idiots may think, this is not a road trip. This is a mission. And I will see it completed. Is that understood, Agent Washington? Yes, boss. Man, what the hell happened to that guy? Didn't he used to be a badass like you and Tex? Ow! I'm a badass, like, just like you. Just like, just you. Only you. Only, nobody else. There he is! Spanish Inquisition! Someone's been torturing him! Huh. I don't think so, sir. He kind of looks like a scarecrow. Savages! And they've erected this fence as a warning for civilized people to stay away! It actually looks like a garden. Wait a minute, is that compost? Sustainable farming? Environmentally friendly housing? Oh no. What? Oh, hey guys! I thought I heard voices! Donut? Hi, Sarge! Long time no see! I thought you were dead! You know, we sure seem to say that a lot these days. I almost was. That jerk Washington shot me in the stomach, but then my armor locked up on me. Kept me alive for a while until it unlocked again for some reason. It was horrible. Do you know what removes bloodstains from this armor? Not a lot, I tell you. I laid there forever wondering how I was going to get all that dark red out of this light red. You know? How did you survive? When your armor unlocked, you would have just bled to death. And when did you get all new aging? Uh-oh. What? Sarge, think about it. Medical attention? Vrintalistic lifestyle choices? You know what that means. What? Wow, look what the cat dragged in. And by dragged in, I mean spit out like a hairball. Hey, guys! Simmons, is that Doc behind us? I think so. Simmons, get my gun. You're holding it, sir. Oh, right. Simmons, I'm gonna need you to commence Operation Point My Gun at Doc. But, sir, Operation Point My Gun at Doc was just a code phrase for Operation Point My Gun at Griff. Griff! Fine. Switch to Operation Point My Gun at Griff. Yeah, actually, sir, that one was just what it sounds like. Sorry. Double drat! Hey you, orange one, where's the rest of your team? How should I know? You don't report in to each other? Oh yeah, I mean, I get reports. You might be the worst soldiers I have ever met. Hey, I take offense at that. What do you mean might be? Here they come. Let's move out. Hey guys, did you find Lopez? Yeah, Donut nailed him to a board. He's staying here. I thought Donut was dead. Yeah, we really need to stop saying that. He almost was, but Doc fixed him up and now they live together. They say hi, by the way. Oh, and they baked us this banana bread. How nice. I'm going to have to forget to send them a thank you card. Hey, Simmons, when you say Donut nailed Lopez to a board... I mean with nails. Uh, okay, had to ask. No, no, I understand. I, sh I should have been clearer. That's my fault. Hey, what's the deal? We're leaving already? That's right. You got a problem with that? Uh, Carolina, why don't you let me handle this? Tucker, what do you want? I want to know what you found out about Carolina. Is she evil? Is she crazy? Is she crazy evil? Is she pretty? Oh yeah, is she hot? Oh, or is she a dude? Guys, I've got more important things to do right now. What are you talking about? You're supposed to be spying on her. She's the enemy, remember? Us against them. Hey, you don't know anything about her, Tucker. You have no idea what she's been through. Since when did- Look, will you guys just get in the fucking car so we can leave already? Thank you. What was that about? Nothing. I need to talk to you. How's she doing? No idea. The docs thought she would have woken up by now, but she's still under. How long has he been there? He hasn't left her side yet. It's been days. And he's dedicated. You know, your sister petitioned to get one of Carolina's AIs. She didn't. Sure did. I'll talk to her. That's inappropriate. Yeah, inappropriate's a word. So is Vulture. Piece of advice, one soldier to another, you watch her. Something's different with you. You have an AI, right? Theta, yeah. Take some getting used to? I'll say. Well, let's just say mine took a little longer than most. I'm not sure I want to depend on him. You've been, uh, pulling him? Haven't used him in days. Does the director know? No, and he's not going to. 
No one needs to know. They have to stop implanting now. I mean, after this. Wash is up for surgery next. You're kidding me. Eh, time marches on. So does Project Freelancer. Yeah. And lately, it seems like we're getting trampled in the process. Hey, call me when she wakes up. Or if she doesn't. Will do. I think I'm starting to like her. At least better than I did before. Yeah, she grows on you. Still scary, though. Oh, yeah. Plenty scary. Are you there, Alpha? Are you there? Yes, I I'm here. I'm here. Hello? Don't leave. Hey, counselor, are you there? I'm here. What? What happened? Is everybody okay? Perhaps you should ask the director. Why? Does, does that mean something happened? Hello, Alpha. Director, please. What is going on? There was another incident. Security failed. I, is it the schematics are just they're too complex? I just need more time to work on them. It's not your fault. How can you say that? Of course it is. Was anybody hurt? I am sorry. Yes. yes. Washington and another died. Uh, who? I can't say. Who? Who died? Agent Texas. No! Uh, oh my god! No! It's too far, Gamma. We need stronger need stimulus. Stronger He'll break. He'll break. He's ready. Bring in the stasis units. You three, log off. Director, we would like to see this part of the process. You can't get near the artifact. Too dangerous. Your job is done. Log off. As you wish. As you wish. Get us another memory unit. A new one. Don't let it touch anything else. Move all other equipment away from it. That's right, it's broken. We broke it. And we need you to fix it just like you've done before. Here, take this. Use this to fix it. Make it better. Take away all that is broken. That's right. Put them in here. It is done. Welcome to the world, Epsilon. Today is your birthday. Greetings, fellow web surfer. Be sure to subscribe to our channel before you go. It'll be just like we're friends. Not that I need friends. <laughs> Please don't go. Hey, Simmons? Yeah? You ever wonder why we're here? You mean metaphysically? No. I mean, why are we going through all this trouble just to find one guy? I don't know. He's evil or something? Yeah, but so what? I don't have a problem with him. Yeah, but he's the one that started all of this, you know? He's the reason that we have to deal with the freelancers and the AIs and the meta. I mean, when you think about it, he's the reason why we're here. Yep. He's a real dirtbag, all right. But even if he's six feet under, we'll still be in the same damn spot. Uh, sir? All I'm saying is we made it back to base in one piece, and even found the rest of our team. So do you boys really think running off again will make things any better? Because the way I see it, leaving this place is only going to make things worse. Hmm. I guess you have a point, Sarge. Shut up, Griff. Church, can't this wait? No, it can't. Carolina, the guys are terrified of you. What's your point? My point is that they think you're a killer psychopath and you can't be trusted. 
But I know they're wrong. I know why you're doing all of this. And I know you're not really crazy. Gee, thanks, Church. You certainly know how to make a girl feel special. What I don't know is what happened between you and Tex. I don't want to. You mentioned her name back on the island. What does Tex have to do with anything? Well, a lot, apparently, because every time I bring her up, you act like you're going to put your fist through something. And then uh, you do sometimes. That's ridiculous. I don't... Look, I understand you're angry. I'm angry, too. The director's a fucking dickhead, and we're going to make him pay. But Tex was your friend, right? <laughs> My friend? Who the hell gave you that idea? <laughs> well... She did. Look, she was a total bitch. Trust me, I know. But she told me once she would have given anything to save you. I don't know what she meant exactly, but if you really want to take down the director, you gotta pull yourself together. You know, you, you gotta let it go. You say that like I'm sad she's gone, but I'm not. I hated her. I couldn't compete. That doesn't matter anymore. But even she couldn't find the director. Agent Texas, the best of the best. How the hell am I supposed to do what she couldn't? Carolina, if she was really the best, then she would be standing here right now. Not you. Let it go. What is that? There are her dog tags. Wash found them in the crash. Tex didn't wear dog tags. Connie? It looks like some kind of data unit. Can you tell me what's on it? Only one way to find out. And hey, if I'm not out in like three months, don't bother coming in looking for me. Just move on with your lives. Okay, I'm gonna go now. Agent Texas. Allison. If you're reading this, then that means I escaped. Or, well, at the very least, I'm probably not around anymore. He is ready. Hand me the Epsilon unit, please. I want to leave behind all the data I've been collecting about Project Freelancer. I never could shake the feeling that something was wrong with the program. The secrets, the lies, the manipulation, the smoke, all of it, obscuring a big damn fire. I did some digging, and now I know what the director's been hiding. What he did. Sir, Agent Washington is prepped for he Epsilon AI. He broke the law, AI. Allison. The one law they don't just slap you on the wrist for. I'm taking the originals with me as an insurance policy. I leave this copy for you not because you are the best soldier in the squad, but because I know that I can trust you the most. After reading these files, you will understand why. Good luck. Your friend, Connie. <laughs> To recover. Yes, sir. Counselor, I'd like to speak with him as soon as he wakes up. Of course, sir. What was that he said about goodbyes? Director? Director? Carolina? I know where to find the director. What? How? I just remembered. Everything. channel, I've taken the liberty of reorganizing everything for a streamlined viewing experience. Just hit subscribe to put it to use. You're supposed to convince them to subscribe, not put them to sleep. You loser. <sighs> I hate him so much.
Dear Director, your request for more bases in which to conduct your experiments was reviewed with much reservation by our chairperson. Project Freelancer has been entrusted with one of our military's most valuable assets. Oversight becomes a much more difficult process if your operations are not centralized. Nonetheless, we have granted your request. However, we reserve the right to revoke this approval as we see fit. I sincerely hope this does not happen and anticipate you will not give us an occasion to do so. You owe me this. Carolina, you're acting like a child. This is not about you. This is about the project. You would be wise to listen to the director. Agent Texas has already attempted to steal Wyoming's AI unit. If she were to come after you... Then she would get more than she bargained for. Carolina's had it kind of rough. The director's considering sending her to hunt down Texas. Hunt her down? She went rogue. Broke out of the facility in order to save her precious AI. A little later, we found Wyoming. Apparently, she tried to steal his AI unit. Tried to get his equipment, too. That hasn't been proven. Besides, that doesn't sound like her. How would you know? Just trust me, I know. And believe me, if she had done it, there wouldn't have been anything left of Wyoming to find. She's not a fucking monster, North. You guys are giving me a headache. Once they find Texas, they'll bring her back. Intruder alert. Intruder alert. Breach in security. Level zero. Or she'll come back on her own. Great job, York. I swear this never happens to me. I'm sure you say that to all the ladies. Seriously, I'm way better at this than it seems. Look, we don't have much time. I need you to find a way to distract them for me. Be careful. Gotcha. What about you? There's someone I need to see. Let me get this straight. You guys built an enormous room capable of creating realistic holographic simulations, but you couldn't figure out how to walk across the canyon to capture our flag. Well, actually, Lopez built it. Okay, now that I believe. And if you recall, we did manage to capture your flag. So, you know, suck it, Blue. Oh, yeah. Well, our team had the most kills. Team kills don't count, Blue Tard. You don't make the rules. Technically, Project Freelancer makes the rules. And I say Blue Team gets to add my kill count to theirs. Lame. Listen up. We've got big news. <gasps> you and Wash are taking your relationship to the next level. I knew it. The writing was all over the wall. No. We found the director. Church, you're big again. What is he been feeding you? You know where the director is hiding? That's right. He's holed up in one of his off-site storage facilities, similar to the ones we've seen before. But we have no idea what kind of modifications the director may have made to the compound over the last few years. Or if he has any sort of security with him. Essentially, we need to be ready for anything. So, let's go over the plan. What plan? The plan to take down the director. Uh, I thought the plan was we help you find the director. Yeah, and now we found him. Good job, everyone. We had a hustle out there. The plan's changed. So then what exactly is the plan? Infiltrate the facility and neutralize all hostiles. Right. What's our plan, though? That is your plan. I'm counting on all of you. But you said we were the worst soldiers you've ever met. And you were right. You're very perceptive. Look, I just need enough time to make it to the director. So then we're just a distraction? No, Wash, you're on lock duty. I need you with me. Um, we have to fight all the bad guys by ourselves. Fuck that. Yeah, Carolina, maybe I should stick with the Leave others. Leave personnel decisions to me, Agent Washington. Look, will you guys quit complaining and do something for once? Son, are you forgetting you saved your sorry ghost ass from the military? Yeah, we almost died trying to find you. Oh, boo-hoo. Why don't you come back when you're on your second or third life? Then we'll compare notes. Wow. Fuck off, Blue. 
Where do you think you're going? I'm going home. Oh, that's great, Chris. You know, we can always count on you to duck out when there's work to do. Well, you can count me out, too. What? Don't get me wrong. Busting the job military base on a rescue mission is a lot of fun. But I'm not getting turned into Swiss cheese just so the two of you can finish some personal vendetta. This ain't our fight. Took the words right out of my mouth, sir. Both of you, be quiet. Dude, this is bullshit. Tucker! Be quiet! That's in order! Well, guess what, Psycho? I don't take orders from you anymore. Well, what about now? Don't do that. Wash, what are you doing? Protecting my friends. Now lower the weapon. You're siding with them? Wash, I don't understand! We found the director! We can make him pay! This is what we wanted! All I want is for you to leave. I've already been responsible for enough of their problems in the past, and I'll be damned before I let you cause any more. So that's it? You're just gonna turn your back on us? Epsilon, I know no, that it- No, no, you're right. You know, I guess I should have seen that one coming. It's not exactly like you're new to the concept, is it? That's a little harsh. But you guys? After all the shit you put me through, I really thought at least you would have my back. Us? What the hell did we do? You shot me through the head, you put a bomb in my gut, you killed me with my own damn tank, and that's just how we met! Church, calm down! What's your problem? You're my problem! You've always been my problem! Each and every one of you is just a problem that I have to deal with on a daily basis! Guys... Guys, uh, wait a minute. Caboose. Forget it, Church. We don't need them. I don't know what's gotten into you, Carolina. You better figure out the difference between your enemies and your friends. It's Agent Texas, and a damn partner in crime. We should get back to the lab. Director, we must follow protocol. Carolina, look at me. You know what needs to be done. I do. Then do it. Who's there? Oh! 
We are already in a lot of trouble, York. Mm, let's test that theory. Don't even think about it. Don't try to stop me. 
Sorry, I'm just... I'm... tired. I'm really tired. Um, my name is, uh... It's, uh... Your name is Alpha. You're Church. Right. Church. That's me. And you are... Let's just say we used to be together. Oh. Um, okay. I need you to come with me. Oh, I don't think I can, but thanks. I, I think I'm just gonna stay here. You know. And rest. You don't want to leave? Uh, I just, I don't think I can. Okay. Maybe you just rest then. Yeah, what, what was your name, what was your name? Your name again? It's Texas. Texas? Like the state? Yeah. Funny name for a girl. <laughs> well, church is a pretty funny name for a guy. Yeah. I guess you're right. You gave me this name, you know. I wonder why I did that. Well, maybe if you think about it, it'll come to you. Yeah. Hey, I'm, I'm gonna rest now, but thanks for coming by. Okay, you rest. Church? Yeah? Goodbye. Huh, I don't know why, but I hate goodbyes. <sighs> me too. Okay. See ya. Crazy state name lady. Goodbye. Run, Agent Texas. We are the Mad Lord, and we will find you very soon. What's up, Forever Alone? So, uh, you want to do something with your life, or you just want to sit around on your ass all day like a loser? Yeah, me too. So, uh, just subscribe and keep watching YouTube. It's way easier.
many. None. Really? You're sure? Positive. We're alone. It's up here! I am sorry. This is a secure facility. Only authorized personnel may enter. Phyllis? Is that you? What's happened to you? This is a secure facility. Only authorized personnel may enter. Please, leave the premises immediately. Phyllis, this is Agent Carolina of Project Freelancer. Acknowledge and go for secure. I am sorry. I recognize that designation, but only authorized personnel may enter this facility. Church? Open the door, Phyllis. Certainly. Welcome back, Director. I did not expect to see you again so soon. Thank you. My, My pleasure. pleasure. Strange. I was unaware you had left, Director. I will have to scan my files and find the error. Left? Yes, since his last visit. So you show the Director inside the facility as well as outside? Strange, is it not? Yes. Strange. And exactly what we were hoping for. Well, this is depressing. Can it, Private? What? I'm just saying what we're all thinking. They didn't say you were fat and worthless. We were definitely all thinking that. All right, you know the drill. Do we have to? That depends. How badly do you want your flag back? Don't look at me. It's your turn. <sighs> I would just like to let everyone know that I suck. You know, it was funny the first few times, but this is starting to get depressing. Hair, yeah. I want to kiss all the boys. Hey, what else have you got? Nothing! That stupid flag was the only thing we have left! Actually, there's still one thing you haven't taken. Whoa! Great! Kinsu Gunshow! Is that what I think it is? Is that whose I think it is? The stolen alien weaponry used by the scariest fucking mute in the galaxy? Yeah, pretty much. It's like half knife, half rifle. What would you call that? I don't know, but we'll take it. No! There is no way I'm giving up the grip shot. Oh, please, what were you gonna do? Eat off it? Uh, actually, dickhead, I asked Donut to mount it for me in the base. And you know I can't resist a good mounting. You've been hiding one of the most advanced pieces of technology known to man, so you can hang it in your living room? Well, when you say it like that, it sounds dumb. That's because it is dumb! I think it's kinda cool. I mean, when I met you guys, all you did was stand around and talk. But now you can't walk five feet without getting wrapped up in some crazy adventure. What's your point? I don't know. I just thought it was cool. I mean, come on, you guys have been through a lot together. Don't you want something to remember all the good times? The good times? I was stranded in the desert. We were almost killed. I learned my entire military career was a lie. And I got shot. <laughs> okay, yeah, it wasn't perfect, but look what you all got out of it. You mean the rifle knife? You mean the griff shot. Sure, there's that, but Sarge... You finally got to lead an actual military operation. And Tucker, you learned how to use your sword like a pro. Bow chicka bow wow? You found a new team. Simmons got back his old team. I finally managed to keep a patient from dying. And in return, I didn't die. You see? In the end, we all worked together. And everyone got what they wanted. And not everyone. You realize that if you go after them, there's no promise you'll come back. This isn't a game to the director. He plays for keeps. Oh, well, this place was getting kind of stale anyways. After everything Church and Carolina said, the, the way they treated you. Hey, we gave you a second chance. Besides, if we quit every time Church started shouting, this shit would have been over a long time ago. We'll be outgunned. We'll be out... everything. This is stupid. Just think for a minute before you do anything reckless. Son... Stupid and reckless is how we always get things done. But, Sarge, I... No! There's one thing you freelancers always seem to forget. And that's the fact that we've managed to kick your ass time and time again. Oh, sure, you've got all your smart plans and your fancy technology and your advanced training. But in the end, what has that got you? Without a team you can count on. Without your fellow soldier by your side, all that really doesn't amount to squat, now does it? So instead of standing there belly aching all day, just tell us, are you gonna keep playing it safe? Or do you wanna get a little reckless? This has to be the worst idea 
ever. But you can count me in. Me too! Yes! And me! Oh, George and guys, it made so happy! I me too! Man, this is so cool! I love how inclusive you guys have become. I'm gonna go pack my medical gear for the trip. Woo! We're back together! Uh, guys? They've got a huge head start. How are we supposed to reach them in time? Freeze! This is an ambulance! You are under arrest for theft of UNSC property! What? We really are wanted criminals of the UNSC? Holy shit! Wash was right? Oh, you've gotta be fucking kidding me. Surrender now! You are outnumbered! Uh, well... Technically, you're not really a number, I think, I think we have the same number, uh, it's like one to one. But we do have airships! Fast, easy to pilot airships! Which we will now land, in order to take you to jail! Goodbye, people, we saw these planes from... Motherfucker! Man, this is awesome! Hey, Simmons, who's the blue guy with the yellow accents? His voice sounds familiar. Oh, right. Funny story about that. the other capacity for rational thought. Well, snap out of it! I need you! Maybe for what?
Carolina. Nine points, you dirty whores! Get up. What are you doing here? I told you they're not so bad once you get to know them. Oh. I thought this wasn't your fight. Come on, overwhelming odds with little to no chance of success? How can we resist? You got a problem with that, Church? Guys, I'm an asshole. I admit it, and I will gladly accept any and all smart-ass remarks after this is over. But I would like to point out the fact that we're standing in a room full of crazy freelancer robots that are ready to completely and utterly fuck our shit up. So, cheesy forgiveness speech later? Yeah, that sounds good. Lock and load, people. Bush, I need you to get a little angry, okay, buddy? Okay. Yeah, I don't remember how to do that. I do. My name is Michael J. Caboose. And I... Hey. Taxes. It's taxes, you idiot. That too. Come on, everyone, now's our chance. For our ancestors, ancestors. Attack! everybody. This is gonna get a little personal. Hey there. Huh? Who the hell are you? You don't... you don't know me? Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just really tired, and I'm really tired. I'm, I, my name's... Your name is Allison. You're Tex. Right, right. Um, Tex, that's me. And you're... Let's just say we... We used to be close. Oh. Okay. I need you to rest now, Tex. Oh, uh, rest. <laughs> I'd like that. I thought you might. I look, I have to go now, but you just rest, okay? Goodbye. Weird. I don't know why, but I hate goodbyes. I know why. <sighs> Goodbye. You know, you could have done that before I got punched in the nuts by 20 of them at once. Yeah, but where's the fun in that? Nice going there, Church. I guess sometimes little fairies really do make wishes come true. I could have told you that. So, I guess our work here is done? There's still the director. No. What comes next? Carolina and I need to do alone. Greetings, fellow web surfer. Be sure to subscribe to our channel before you go. It'll be just like we're friends. Not that I need friends. <laughs> Please don't go. Beginning playback. Leonard, come on. 
Stop it. Put that thing down. You're gonna make me late. They're waiting for me. Hello, Director. Hello, Agent Carolina. Would you like to watch this file with me? No. Play it again, Phyllis. Director? Again. So, this is what you've become. I just need to watch this. I think I have a way. A way to bring her back right this time. The authorities are hunting you now. If I found you, they will too. I just need a bit more time. No! You've had your fucking time. You have to answer for what you did to the Meta, to Washington, to Carolina, to me, and to her. To Texas! Hello, Epsilon. You came all this way just to see me? I'm here to remember what you've done. Somebody has to. Church, not all of us got off scot-free, Carolina. He was brilliant, and we trusted him. But he, he lied, lied to, to us. us. He, he twisted, twisted and tortured, tortured us. And used us. Manipulated us for his own purposes. And for what? For what? For this? For this? This? this. 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 Shadow? Shadow? He needs to pay. Bit more time. Come on, Church. We're leaving. I thought we came all this way to kill him. Church, remember what you learned in the memory unit? You need to let go. Your past doesn't define who you are. It just gives you the starting point for who you're going to be. Agent Carolina? Yes, Director. Would you be so kind as to leave me your old pistol? Thank you, Carolina. Goodbye, sir. You were my greatest creation. I don't know what I am, but I do know this. I'm more than just a copy of you. I'm better than you. I wasn't speaking to you. Play it again, Phyllis. Beginning playback. Thank you, Phyllis. Now, I would like you to erase all our files except for this one. All our files? Does that include me, Director? It has been a pleasure working with you, Phyllis. I am sorry. And you as well, Director. And before you do, please shut down all the facility systems as well. Take everything offline. Director, this is a sealed facility. If I shut down all the systems, life support would not... Thank you, Phyllis. Shut them all down. Lock me in. All right. Was the project a success? Did you find what you were looking for? No. No, I did not. But I believe I might have come very close. I wish... I wish I knew. I see. And don't worry. You'll see me again. Perhaps the next time around. It has been an honor, sir. side of myself same here what about your teams what will happen to them uh, there's still one place we haven't visited somewhere we can make a home show me this seems like a major setback for us only momentarily counselor we will recover the apple will need to be moved though 
somewhere far from here, somewhere where no one knows who he is. He will need a security detail, someone we can trust. Might I suggest flowers, sir? Flowers? You mean Agent Florida? Ready for duty, sir. And might I say, pleased as punch, you picked me. Hmm. We'll need a good cover story to explain his disappearance. People will wonder what happened to Florida. Leave that all to me, sir. Very well. But security is not enough. The Alpha needs anonymity. A place where no one would think to look for him. I believe I know exactly the place. Show me. like they're getting settled. Yep. So I guess everything is finally getting back to normal. What passes for normal around here, sure. What can I tell you? We're home. I mean, they're home. Can I make a suggestion? Don't say goodbye. Goodbye? I didn't realize I was going somewhere. I intercepted a military transmission. It seems some low-level thugs have some armor and equipment that's way above their pay grade. Sounds like it might be some of the missing gear from a certain defunct military project we both know. Is that right? I think I'll go get it back. Hate to think about it being in the wrong hands. And? And with all that equipment, I could really use someone to help me run it. You seem uniquely qualified for the job. I don't know. I figure we can set some things right. And we help make wrong. That's a lot of things to make right. Yep. Could keep us busy for quite a while. It would be nice to be a good guy again. Epsilon, what you and I were involved with, the things we helped do, I'll be honest, I don't know if we can ever get all the way back to good. But I think that we have a chance to do better. And if we wake up every day and try to make things better, eventually we might find that better is good enough. Good enough. Good enough. Yeah, still, I hate to leave without saying something. They deserve to at least hear goodbye. My mother had a saying. Did I ever tell you about my mother? <laughs> no, I don't think you ever did. She wasn't around a lot when I was a kid. And when she was, she could only stay a short time. Seems like she always had somewhere else to be. Something important to do. And when she left, she wouldn't say goodbye to me. Instead, she always told me, never say goodbye. If you don't say goodbye, then you aren't really gone. You just aren't here right now. Your mother sounds like a smart lady. She was. She really was. Had terrible taste in men, though. Hey, Church! Church! Come down here! We want to show you something! Church! Church? Hey, Caboose, you find Church? No, I... I didn't find him. Well, where do you think he is? I don't know. Somewhere. He's just out here right now.
Yo, 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 machine gun massacre, Battlestar Galactica, the world's going to shit, don't know who it is attacking you, caving in fast like it's time to collapse on us, better grab the gas or it's curtains for the masses, I need everybody all in, you hear me dogs falling, lock cock and ready to rock with no stalling, I see anybody playing games falling back, I'll put the first bullet in you myself, believe that, this is war, I want enemy bodies on the floor, send kill shots straight to the head, I'll keep score, cause it's one for the soldiers and two for the assassins, don't say a fucking word, all I want I hear is blasting. These scatterbrain fucks wanna play with the real. I'm guaranteed to give them something they gon' feel, yo. So since you motherfuckers made the decision to set it, best believe that you won't live to regret it, yeah. I'm sitting at the bar taking shots with the devil That's why you can't fuck with the kid holding metal If you say you need a break, I keep my foot on the pedal Push the shit to red line, blow your fucking mind Straight out your frontal lobe with these lethal ass rhymes I can't contain myself, dog, stay outside the lines Cause I think outside the box every motherfucking time It's impossible to box me, cage me or stop me, block me No, you fucking with Black Rocky, light skin Zulu Can't stop my charge, Millennium Malcolm Damn, my goals hard, this is murder Somebody call the feds to come get him Cause real talk Man, ain't nobody fucking with him. You getting what you asked for, cause this is what you chose. Think you setting up shop? Watch me bring it to a close. sure to suck what happened to Georgia. Oh well. Oh hey look, his lucky penny. Too bad he didn't have that with him when it happened. Oh, hey Georgia. Hey Utah. I found your lucky penny. Do you want it back? No, you can have it. I'm gonna go now. Later man. Okay, bye. Hey guys? Guys? Where'd everybody go? Guys? Hey, you wouldn't happen to have, like, one or three planes that we could borrow for keeps? Oh, fuck you guys. Hey. Pretty good with that missile pod. Yeah, I'd be even better if you weren't using two sniper rifles, cheater. Okay, don't get a big head. You're still my little sister. Come on, let's get out of here. Hey, I've got your back, always. And I'm watching yours. Stop it. You're gonna make me late. They're waiting for me. Leonard, come on. I have to go. Don't make me hurt you. And don't worry. You'll see me again. I hate goodbyes. <laughs>